Our downstairs neighbor and water leaking down. There we go. There we go. Yeah, I don't know what happened. I had to go around and inspecting everything and making sure nothing was... But there's nothing, man. I don't even know if it's us. At this point, I'm like, I'm kind of like, I don't even know if it's our, if it's our flat. I have no idea. Um, but yeah. Alexa, order a large pack of Tenor Lady. Tenor Lady. What is that? Oh, no. Oh. Tenor Lady is. <laughs> I, just, I just Googled it. I know what Tenor Lady is now. Thank you, Deets. No, not that kind of leaking. We're good. Different kind of leaking. Different kind of leaking. Yeah, Sophie. Oh, no. <laughs> My... If anyone's bum leaks... It's Florence. It's Florence. Filling the board? Paranoia. Thank you for filling the board. Yeah, yeah. Marimo, how you doing? Good Love to see you. Love you, Sophie Poppet. Sophie. Sophie. What? Deet says she loves you, Poppet. Oh, I love Deet. You love Deet? She's the only one I love. Deet is the only one you love. I don't love anyone else. Not even Flo? No, she just ran away from me. I was trying to pick her up. Yeah, that happens. But yeah, chat, Paranoia, thank you for filling the board. That's all 10 spots filled. Nice. Love to see it. Um, and yeah, awesome. Thank you, guys. Chat, we got a little Spono today. So please bear with us with that. We're going to we're gonna play together. We're going to have some fun. Um, but, um, it, it, you know, it's been, a, it's been a crazy day. I went, uh, woke up, did some, did some like, computer stuff. And then um, I went to, um, went to the gym. And then nothing really happened, really. Nothing happened. Apart from aliens got confirmed. That's the thing. A spoon. Yeah. A spoon. We have a spoon today. Aliens. Chat. Aliens. X3 brand gets Twitter blocked under e Indonesia's p porn laws. Yes! Man, Elon is, uh, yeah, Elon. Been banned anyway for, for porn. Porn? I've seen. I've seen all kinds of shit on. Some I've seen all kinds of things on that website, man. But yeah, chat, um, we, uh, I mean, I don't know if you guys saw this. It's kind of crazy. Before we get into the big stuff, Ryan Rampage, Woo! thank you for follow. Thank you follow. Um, did you guys, what the fuck? camera's not on. Well, I thought we would be producing that one. Hmm? The middle camera. Oh, my camera's not on. Um, but look at this. What's this? Oh, oh God. That's really bad. Very, very bad. Oh, Jesus. This is in New York. Holy shit. What the fuck? Can we please big up? This fucking... Uh, you hang on. Uh, you can't see it's behind chats in the way. Uh, this fucking content creator right here clearly being like, oh, this is gonna get numbers. Jesus Christ. Oh, I've got, got to film it. this. Mate, I think they're on FaceTime. They're talking to someone. Getting this on 4K. I think they're literally Getting like... this on 4K. Did you fucking see that? It's falling down. Um, so yeah, apparently a few people got injured. As you can imagine. Nobody died? Nobody died. That's Very good. lucky. I'm not gonna lie. Nobody died. Yeah. The guy who rode under on a bicycle, on his bicycle. It's got, you know, it's got places to be, I mean, mate. you're still zooming. Dude, that would be terrifying. Game. Imagine being in the opposite building when it like when it goes donk, like oh fuck, bonk. Ooh, that's a lot of weight being thrown around. I'm just saying. And then yeah, the the arm just falls off. That was my arm today after deadlifts, chat. <laughs> well, it's not like real. Lol, it is like real. Brian, that's, that's real. That's real. Like that. Sometimes things do happen. Hey, someone give me a background light, man. He's turned off all my stuff. Someone, someone, go, go, go. There's multiple camera shots. Yeah, also, what... What Crazy. would be the... Who would... Thank why you. would... Not red! Come on, I'm wearing... I'm wearing purple. Think about it. No, I'm just kidding. It's fine. Um, <laughs> uh, but yeah, that's crazy, man. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks. I'll take blue, I'll take purple, I'll take pink. They're all fun. <laughs> 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 I love you, chat. You make me laugh. Um, Cubit, how are you doing? This is my leftover coffee from this morning. Oh, yeah. So, yeah, basically, is our house leaking, perhaps? Every leaking. time, Every time we're accused of leaking, we're not it. Leaking. Chat yeah. optimizing the single brain cell. Look, everybody's sharing it today, and they're doing their best. Also, I, like, tied my hair up rather than pinning it, and it looks all flat. Look nice. Not flat. Look nice. No, I'm just gonna I look like it. a wizard. I'm just going to hold it up. I look like I need a staff. Like, I need I to be like, you! Show not. Brad, you do not have Gandalf's level of rose. Let's be honest with ourselves. You can't just jump in at wizard level Gandalf the Great. I, I, I got that rose. Yeah. 
I got that right. But anyway. I could stop a Balrog. I benched 200 today. I could stop a Balrog. I benched something. Did... I'm not. I'm unclear <laughs> as to what numbers I benched, but I benched something. Um, but yeah, no, I, look, I could... I benched like 80 pounds, I think. I could go toe-to-toe -to -toe with a Balrog, maybe. No, what did really. I do? How much did I do? Um... Fuck, is there a video of it? I don't remember. You did, it was, you did 10 on each mm. side, plus the... I think you did like 31 kilograms? What's that in poons? 31 kg, two Oh, I pounds. don't have the video. You did like 70 pounds. I benched 70 poons! Yeah, that's good. Come at me! Chat, I can bench your leg! Are you okay? I just regurgitated everything. Um, <laughs> everything I've ever oh eaten. Oh my god, the bubble. What? The bubbles. The bubbles. <laughs> yeah, but this is from like a few days. Okay? Chat, this is from um, a few days collection. If M. we hit 700 subs, I'm going to live on stream make a tower of the cans currently on Fred's desk so that you can mock him. Yeah. Yeah! Um, but chat, I kind of feel like there's only one thing to talk about today. There's only one thing, and it's crazy! There's only one thing to talk about today, and it's... Aliens. Have I, have I sent any zeets? Oh, fucking zeets. Is it actually... We're officially, mm -hmm. we're officially Z, like, X now, right? Yeah. Well, Twitter's, tw it's not even Twitter anymore. Well, well apparently... I'm still going to Twitter. I'm gonna still what's funny Twitter. is that South Africans are saying that the X in a word like that is usually used for like a um a kind of sound in Nosa. I thought it was an exclamation mark, but yeah. No, no, there, well, there's lots of different uh, languages okay. that use like clicking sounds, right? Of course. So there's a, there's a language called Nosa, right? Nosa. That's what it's called. Okay. And it is one of uh, South Africa's. Um, we need to start getting some clicks in our words. You can't just start stealing clicks, all right? Everyone else has got everyone else has got clicks. Maybe so, uh, for Eddie. Or you can't be. Fuck. So fucking deal with it. Or fuck. No. No. It's <laughs> also not how it works. It's like an extra letter. Yeah, I know. So it would not be the same word anymore. But the point I was trying to make is adding an X in like that usually implies it has a click in it, like in Nosa. So everyone's like, well, all of us South Africans are calling them eats. Yeah. <laughs> and I was like, that's Have you gone funny. to Dot com. <laughs> yeah, literally. Everyone's like, Elon, you're South African. You know this. I'm so confused. So that was quite interesting. Um, and I thought it was kind of funny because I was like, yeah, Elon. fucking." If I mocked it. Fred for the Cantonese desk, I'd be mm. a hypocrite. Thank you, C2. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, At least you, there's only one honest person in the stream. There's only... <laughs> and it's C2 because I'm looking at Emily's desk and it's, it's receptacle, 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 receptacle. One receptacle. One, two, three, four. Two receptacles from yesterday. Three receptacles. Okay, and that's our shared water jug. Four receptacles. Yeah. And then there's also like a hairbrush. Are we going to start doing... I will start pulling out cans. <laughs> Chat can guess how many cans. <laughs> and they will not guess. Look. It's, only, it's, like, it's like four. It's like four cans. Yeah, I'm not going to lie, Scotty. No one has used that in six years. I have... I don't know. Mm -hmm. No, there's a exclamation mark bulb. Oh, and yeah. And it's like, yep. No, does Bulb even exist admit, anymore? No, it does not. Oh, okay. I was going to say, are we even with Bulb? I'm just died? figuring out what they do. Why? You don't need to figure out what every command does. Tommy's like, I'm a future mod. I need to know <laughs> these things. I'm preparing. He's studying. He's studying for the mod exam. <laughs> but why? It's fine. You're not going to figure out what they do. It's not a problem, Tommy. You go You go ahead and explore the commands. It's weird. And I, and I, find, you, and I find it strange. But I'm okay with that. <laughs> Everyone else in the stream is weird and strange as well. All right. That can't be there. Oh. Well, you moved it from where it was in the first place. Um... <laughs> But yeah, chat, there's only one thing to really discuss. There is, there's only one thing to talk about because everything else is fucking nonsense and we don't need, even really need to know about it. It's, you, they had a UFO or UAP hearing in America UAP in Congress show. with three mm -hmm. people um, sat down, questions for hours, right? Oh, baby, they're out there. So they're out there. Who are they questioning? So they are questioning, um, it was three individuals whose names I, uh, Grush... There was another G name Wait, as well. it just said there. So, former U.S. intelligence agents, in, intelligence agent, agent David, David Grush, Grush, while testifying to Congress in the UFO hearings, just scared the crap out of me. Right, don't read anymore. Okay. Because it's going to be, it's, it's fun. We need to. I'm just trying to see, like, because I understand um, that So these are people <clears throat> who worked for... What, the CIA? I don't know if they were for CIA. I know one of them's a U.S. Navy commander currently right? serving. 
So, um, oh my god, that's scary. Yes, <laughs> I'm glad you're with me. It's in, it's very, very, very odd. It's no, it's it's weird, man. Mm -hmm. If you guys haven't been paying attention, um, mm -hmm. you guys will be you have your minds burned a little bit. If you guys are paying attention, we might cover something that you might not even know about. So yeah, um, we have got from we got Ryan Graves, David Grush, and David Fra uh, Fravor. Um, who are sworn to testify during a House subcommittee hearing on the UAPs mm -hmm. on Capitol Hill today. Like, it, it ended mm -hmm. like an hour ago, or like not even an hour ago. Um, and there's a whole bunch of stuff, man. I, um, I wonder if I can get a bit more... Let me, let's Google these people. I need to find, mm -hmm. figure out who exactly they are. So we've got Ryan, Ryan Graves. Um, it's an ice hockey defenseman. No, that's not right. <laughs> that's the wrong Graves. That is the concern. Basically, ex-Navy pilot who spotted UFOs that's that guy. Former Navy pilot. So Graves is a Navy pilot. Okay, cool. He flew, he saw him. Now, I think if you paid any attention to alien stuff at all, you will know for a fact that people, a lot of people have said, I saw shit <clears throat> moving in ways that it like was, isn't supposed to, or mm -hmm. like I wouldn't be able to replicate weird little tiny things that just like accelerate like crazy off. And everyone's like, what the hell is that? They've been talking about those for like easily 10 years, probably yeah. longer. Um, and I've always been very suspicious, personally, of the whole UFO conversation. Because one, universe very big, galaxy very large. What are the chances that they found us? Not that huge. Simultaneously, I do also think that it's kind of convenient that back in the day, everyone was seeing discs. Everyone was seeing saucers. And now everyone's seeing spheres. <clears throat> and I'm like, that's very iPod of you. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. To be all like... Oh, no, we're over sources now. And whatever they were doing with sources is cringe. Well, they, they are still talking about sources mm -hmm. is kind of the thing. Like we, it's, it's, it's an interesting discussion. Like <laughs> Five years of regret. Holy moly. Five years. <laughs> oh, my God. Shove on. Oh, so much. months. Woo! And then we've got Dragon Woo! Boy coming in immediately after 45 months. Dragon Boy. Oh, yeah. Happy hump day, my dudes. Chat, if you would like to win a free game, because Siobhan just hit three steps to the side in a game giveaway. Yeah, you did. If you'd like to win a free game, type exclamation mark, enter, and make sure you are following if you're a tier two or a tier three sub. Do nothing. You're automatically entered. Um, All right, so we've got David, um, mm -hmm. we've got David Grush, who served for 14 years as an intelligence officer mm -hmm. in, the, in the Air Force and a National Geospatial Intelligence a Agency. Appeared before the House uh, Oversight Committee's National Security Subcommittee alongside two former fighter pilots mm -hmm. who had first-hand experiences with UAPs. We also had um, Graves, who is a former Navy pilot, and spoken out about um, encountering UAP on training missions, and David Fr uh, Fravor, who shot uh, the now-famous Tic Tac video of a large object during uh, a flight off the coast of California. I'm pretty sure I've seen this one. Yeah, 2004. Can you click on it? Can you see the Tic Tac video? Uh, I mean, I could just Because it was a link. So oh, there we go. That's what I was I was saying, can we see it? Yeah. Right, chat. Hang on. No, the website's broken. Does CBS work? Watch now on Paramount Plus. What? what? No, I will not watch now. No, Hang what? On. Mate, before TikTok, there was Tic Tac. Paramount Plus apparently have the rights to it. The US intelligence. Girl, hey, you can play me the video. Uh, there's a blob in the middle there. So this is the All right, tic tac, the tic -tac. Video. Where's my tic tac? This does not look very good quality. Two thousand four. Like the little breath time. mint, uh, in in larger scale, uh, but white, oblong, no apparent. Like oh, surfaces, is it that blob? No mm -hmm. Oh, who uh, is this? Propulsion. It was like a big mosquito. <laughs> yes, but you got to remember that these guys are all trained to classify. like know what everything is. Well, I don't think it's actually and a mosquito. No, 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 mosquitoes no, no. moving at 80 miles an no, hour. No, but there's been a lot of people. It's three foot long. There's been a lot of people talking about about the the tic tac and saying st pizza pixie death stranding. Oh, Woo! good game. People have been talking about it being like, it doesn't look like anything. And it's like, yes, but you have to understand this is just a copy. You know, we actually, the, the guys who are watching it, and they, they, it's, they're highly trained, man. This is like some expensive gear. They're not just going to put any, they're not going to put me on it and be like, Fred, what's that? I'm going to be like, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I No, no, no. I do, I, yeah, I yeah, obviously yeah, yeah. do agree. I'm not I arguing with you. I'm just saying. Like, was arguing really with its naming as a Tic Tac. Yeah. I barely see that as a Tic Tac personally. But, um, so. So yeah, the Tic Tac video is really famous and stuff like that. So yeah, the these people like came out a while ago and they said we believe that there's UFOs and we think that people should know about it. 
which is fine. Um, and then on top of that, now I guess Congress have said we need to talk to them about the accusations they've made and what the truth is and get to the bottom well, of it. Well, there's been enough. Mm-hmm. There's, been, there's enough. been a lot. There's been enough stuff mm-hmm. happening that, that now everyone's sort of like, what's actually going mm-hmm. on, eh? Mm-hmm. What's actually going mm-hmm. on? So we've got this, this, uh, this interesting video, uh, which I, I'm not going to lie. How do you know that these were not our aircraft? Some of the behaviors that we saw in a working area, we would see these objects uh, being at 0.0 Mach, that's zero airspeed, over a certain pieces of the ground. So what that means, just like a river, if you throw a bobber in, it's going to float downstream. These objects were staying completely stationary in category four hurricane winds. These same objects would then accelerate to supersonic speeds, 1.1, 1.2 Mach, uh, and they would do so in very erratic and, and quick behaviors that we don't, I don't have an explanation for. How do you? So that is the thing I'd heard before. And that's a fighter pilot. Was they will sit like completely still and then just go zoop and just yeah. take off with Mark, like no real acceleration, yeah. which is very unusual. I'm right? pretty sure Mach 1 is uh, supersonic. It's faster yeah. than sound. So mm-hmm. it's like it's, it's like a lot of acceleration for suddenly going from zero to like faster than sound. Mm-hmm. Big deal. Big deal. Um, can just hurry up and blow us up? I think they might be here to like. I've. Dude, I've <laughs> I've, uh, I've seen a bunch of people basically mm-hmm. say, like, they're here, they're going to enslave us and subject us to torturous four hour, four hour working days. <laughs> and ever, it's like, why are the humans celebrating? We don't understand. Um, yeah, he said 1.1, Siobhan. Yeah, so it's, it's like basically faster. I don't know what Can the. Can I log- assume one is. Sound of speed. Sound speed of sound. Yeah. Sound of speed. Sound of speed. <laughs> speed it's of sound. Sound of speed. Um, but I don't. Yes, I don't know if it's like a magnitude thing. Yeah, I know, don't know where, either. Like, where one point one is more than way more. Yeah, yeah I, don't I don't know, know. either. I don't know about that sort of mm-hmm. stuff. But we've also got. Um, yeah, this was happening while I was in the gym today. It was very yeah. stressful. Yeah. Um, so. Wow, this is quite the testimony on Capitol Hill during the UFO hearings. Mm-hmm. Let's watch the video first because I feel like the videos kind of like speak for themselves quite a bit they move is essentially um, ways in which current technology or aircraft that we know of are unable to actually function or move. And so will you just, for the public record, again, once, once again, um, just uh, briefly uh, dis- either describe or note that aircraft that are being witnessed, particularly by the 30 folks that you're working with, are essentially outside the scope of anything that we know of today and the technology we have today. Mr. Graves, Mr. Fravor. Yes, uh, the objects that are being seen by commercial pilots are uh, performing maneuvers that are unexplainable due to our current understanding of our technology and our capabilities as a country. And that applies for the military as well. Mr. 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 Fair. Yeah, I concur with that. We have nothing that can stop in midair and go the other direction, nor do we have anything that can, like in our situation, come down from space, hang out for three hours, and go back up. Thank you. My last question, and, so, and sometimes you, I know that some, you have also said some of these answers. By the way, that last guy... Um, <laughs> Commander Fravor retired. He's a U.S. Navy commander. This is like a proper. That's high up. He's like, no, nope, I've Thank seen all the planes, and, so, and, and this isn't any of them. Some, you have also said some of these answers in the past. But we're trying to get them on the public record as well, which is really important. Mr. Gress, finally, do you believe that our government is in possession of UAPs? Uh, absolutely, based on interviewing uh, over 40 witnesses over four years. And, and and where? I know the exact locations. At- but tell me. I'll go. I'll check it out. I'll Dude. Tell I'll be able to tell. Um, mm-hmm. So, yeah. So, <laughs> Siobhan, literally. <laughs> so, uh, questions specifically about UFOs and whether or not any man-made objects could move in, the way, uh, move in the ways in which these unidentified objects have been seen moving. All three of the witnesses, including former Navy pilot Ryan Graves and U.S. Navy Commander David Fravor, uh, say it's impossible. Uh, when questioned further and asked about whether the U.S. government is housing these aircraft anywhere, David Grush, who is a former U.S. intelligence official, said under oath that he knows of the exact locations in which they are being housed. No matter what your thoughts on aliens or UFOs, I think it's safe to say that all Americans want answers, and I applaud the Republicans and Democrats for getting together and holding these hearings. No, always, always fuck the Republicans, fuck them, and the Democrats. Uh, personally, I think it's impossible uh, that there is no life on other planets. No, that's like a mathematical, mm-hmm. like math- mathematically, there is another. Li- there are some people out there on fucking y.com on a different planet, <laughs> tweeting about or like fucking sending messages about like they're uh, yeeting, they're yeeting, we're yeeting, they're yeeting, they're, they're yeeting about whether or not humans exist. This, do you know what I mean? <laughs> um, the question remains, however, if that life is advanced enough to traverse across space to reach Earth. 
The other question is whether or not it is physically possible to travel such long distances in a, uh, sp a species lifetime. And uh, you can talk about like fucking being stasis. You can also talk about whether the fact these are drones or not. Do you know what I mean? Um, what are your thoughts? Blah blah blah. We don't care. Um, okay, th this one, this yeah. one, this one's fucky. This one's fucky. Okay, mm -hmm. this one is a little bit like a bit monka s. Do you believe our government has made contact with intelligent extraterrestrials? Something I can't discuss in public setting. Um, okay, I can't ask when you think this occurred. <laughs> um, if you believe we have crashed craft, uh, stated earlier, do we have the bodies of the pilots who piloted this craft? As I've stated publicly already in my News Nation interview, uh, biologics came with some of these recoveries. Yeah. Biologics came with the recoveries. Go what? Um, were they, I guess, human or non-human biologics? Non-human, and that was the assessment of people uh, with direct knowledge on the program I talked to that are currently still on the program. So. It was Doug's. Th that's what I'm saying. Non-human. Bitch, Florence is non-human. But if you throw her in a UFO and toss her out the window, she'll die just like anybody else. Well, it's they like. They crashed into a moose. <laughs> this is what I'm saying, Scotty. Well, they, I think the, the, mm. the specific thing was it was found uh, not only with, but like it was like. Yeah, literally. I think the implication, mm -hmm. I think, is understood. I don't think he's answering it in, a, in like, a very dry way. She's I think... asked the question wrong. She needs to be like, is it Earth? Is it is it genetics that could be found on Earth feasibly? IMO, this guy is already a whistleblower about the UFO programs. I think that he's answering it honestly in the context that has been asked. Mm -hmm. if, you, if you really, truly ask me... Uh, Ask me my opinion. Mm -hmm. I think he is saying it's not a moose, it's not a cat, there's not a fucking chimpanzee on a on a fucking yeah, firework. Yeah, yeah. This is we found non-human mm -hmm. pilots as well. I don't no, know. I totally get that. I just feel like he needs to be clearer. Yes. Because it feels a little bit like one of those things where you make people think a, th a certain thing and then, yeah, you crash into a moose or, yeah, there was a non-human pilot in it, but then, like, one time we put a dog in a spaceship, so things happened. Unless you saw it, it's all nonsense. Negative. I completely disagree. Uh, this is high. This is, like, all military shit, man. This is all reports. Report, like, reports. It's mm -hmm. not like Dave down, down mm -hmm. road saw fucking... It's all hearsay. Military reports, though, Scotty. You got to remember, this isn't just like this isn't just like Dave down the road. It's different. It's completely different. We're talking about pilots, and pilots are really fucking high up in in like the hierarchy. You're talking about sort of like reports, and he was like an ex like fucking C like intelligence officer and stuff like mm -hmm. that. This isn't just hearsay. This is like, yeah, it's uh, it's a, it's a lot bigger than hearsay. It's a lot more military. Yeah, military. I feel like military hearsay is like worth like twenty times like fucking well, Dave down the road. I don't. Okay. So I don't think either of you are wrong, right? No, like, I'm, yeah, I agree. Obviously, it would not have gotten necessarily to this level if there weren't some credence to be lended to it, right? Mm -hmm. We wouldn't be sitting here discussing it in the um, in Congress if these people didn't at least have enough of a decent track record to like be reasonable people to speak to. These are obviously not complete lunatics. That being said, we all have to remember, what was it, two years ago when that guy from Google was saying, oh, yes, I've spoken to AI and course, it's completely sentient. And then it turns out that he basically wants to say everything's sentient because he's anti-abortion. But also... So, and I'm not saying that... Like, no, 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 I'm no, not I saying agree. that that... I'm just... I 100% agree with you. Mm -hmm. But also, this is this is a... Uh, this isn't like an opinion mm -hmm. thing, um, which I guess that was. This is also the guy who's basically uh, saying, from his uh, evidence of 40 interviews... Um, mm -hmm. and all that sort of stuff. It's, it's, to me, this goes a little bit beyond sort of like, yeah, I would also say some it, guy chatting shit. It feels unfair in this case when clearly so much of this, if it is out there, has been deliberately covered up to turn around and say, well, unless it's all on the table, then none of it's true. Like, that's not how whistleblowing works. No, yeah, Does that no, make sense? Scott, like, I feel like you, a, that's a naive I, statement. Can I, can I finish what I was saying before you, like, Sorry, I'm just saying to be a whistleblower mm -hmm. requires you to have a a certain amount of information, but also the knowledge that this information is not going to otherwise be made public. Otherwise, you're not whistleblowing. You're just talking about something. Yeah. So we have to bear in mind that turning around and saying like at the end of the day, I don't personally think that there is a correct way to feel about this. You can be like, yeah, 100 percent. I believe it. I think it's real. You can be like, I 100 percent don't believe it. I don't think it's real. I don't think 
at that point, it's just hearing the information and making your own decision. You no, know, like, and like I said, like mm -hmm. I don't, I'm not saying that we should absolutely believe this. Mm -hmm. What I am saying is that this is more than day. This is more than hearsay. This is like a little bit above here. This is like yeah, yeah, I would, a lot yeah, above I would agree. I mean, yeah. he's saying he's interviewed a lot of people. He's saying that he has got. I mean, we've uh, got certain video evidence from back in the day that. Bear in mind as well, that video evidence was from 2004. Any military tech from any country that was happening nearly 20 years ago would be the norm by now. So even if that, because my, my take on it when the Tic Tac and all those videos came out was, oh, this is clearly some tech that another country is working on that America haven't cottoned on to yet. And that's pissing them off, right? But then where where are those things? If there's if there is still nothing that moves like that, it certainly does add some questions to well, what the fuck was it? You know, like creating a better improved propulsion system isn't something that would be like keep it on the down low for 20 years and not used in anything. And it's also just a level of how, how if they if they are like being mm -hmm. completely honest about everything. Right. Mm -hmm. If if the if what the the most mm -hmm. I mean add every other military mm -hmm. budget in the world together and you still don't come close to what America spend. Mm -hmm. And they, they are spending a lot of it on research and development. Yeah. And if their equipment is measuring these things and it's accurate, which I can only imagine it is because military tech is mm -hmm. far and beyond what any, like uh, whatever, whatever mm -hmm. the fuck we have. Like they had GPS years before mm -hmm. we got it. Then yeah, we've got like objects that are coming down from space, hovering for three hours and going back up into mm -hmm. space. We don't have anything like that. It's like a, it's like a factorial beyond the tech we have, yeah. which is a bit more than, what are China doing? What are Russia up to? Mm -hmm. What's, you know, well, what's Japan? That was always my take. My yeah. take was always, oh, well, China's doing something. Yeah. China, it, obviously. That's what I thought as well at the beginning. But like just the, the level, how much higher it is. Yeah. It's like, ah. Uh. And that's kind of the thing. And that's what I'm saying is if we're looking at a video from nearly 20 years ago and saying we still don't have that technology mm. in the world, that's crazy. Yeah. Like, let's say a similarly leaked video had come out of a smartphone. I don't know if smartphones were out by then. I don't think they were in 2004. I don't remember. Um, but let's say there was similarly, look at this. It's got a touch screen. It's doing all of these things. It's connecting to the mm -hmm. internet. Mm -hmm. Wow, that's great. I mean, obviously, that's not as crazy as something that's doing something that we don't really understand how you're doing physics. But, and now we're all holding iPhones. You'd go, oh, so that was some leaked tech yeah, that yeah. just hadn't made it into the public yeah, yet yeah. as happens and also yeah. there's a lot of very specific things that can be used in the military like very specific like oh we can we can make this work on something this size but if yeah. it gets one inch bigger it explodes so it's really useless for anybody outside of a military environment but do you know what i mean do, so it's so, a, it's you know a level of saying? technology like, that they're, that they're yeah. witnessing that is sort of like the concerning part, right? Mm -hmm. It's like, okay. Thanks, Mr. Coco. Back in the day, it might have been like, oh, there's like some like tech that some other countries developed. How have they done this? What? Why are they ahead of us? What the fuck? That's the reason why you know, America mm -hmm. likes to go to other mm -hmm. countries and be like, you're smart, come with me. And um, so, yeah, it's, it's, mm -hmm. it's, you know. I always, the, the doubt I had from my argument mm -hmm. of it's China was always based on that. America spends the most money on its military and America goes around and picks out all of the most brilliant people that they can and say, hey, come over and live in America and have done that historically for a long time. Mm -hmm. So I'm not saying that other governments aren't doing things, yeah. but it's kind of crazy if somebody was so far outstripping America, Yeah, which, I mean, that was literally it the Cold be, War. You know? It would be like witnessing, mm -hmm. like, um, another country like regrow a limb, mm -hmm. like someone gets their arm cut off and they they have just no arm, mm -hmm. well one arm, and then um, next time you see them they got they got both arms again, and you're like, mm -hmm. what happens? Like, oh, I just grow it back. Mm -hmm. That's like the level. That's like the disproportionate level. Mm -hmm. And we're like, well, how did you do that? And it's like that's like we don't even <laughs> we can't even imagine that. You know what I mean? And it's like that's like the level of like tech difference we're seeing. Yeah, which is I think the idea of Siobhan with his go bag. Like, I'm ready. <laughs> Take me to California. I'm going to live somewhere um, warm. Also, I was just going to ask C2 what he meant. Is that okay? No, it's fine. Sure. Sorry, you like give it a little huff. I wasn't sure. Oh, no, I was just like um, exhaling because I was like, I breathed into talk. Right. Um, there's some, all I know is there's some ranking official at the USA, USA, Air, US Air Force. For Air Force. Um, that is laughing because it was a party balloon. And yes, they know where it is because it's in a drawer in the storage facility. You're talking about that balloon from China that everyone was like, ah, it's a balloon. And then it was nothing. And I also agree with you on that, C2. All of the triangle UFO sightings <laughs> were when the F fucking two dyslexic to say it, 117 and the B2 were in development, right? But then that highlights this even more as strange because when you then look later and go, oh, everything was a fucking triangle, and look, we were making some triangle-ass fucking planes. That makes sense, mm -hmm, right? Mm -hmm. But then when you're looking at this shit, and you're like, well, where the fuck's the Tic Tac 20 years down the line? Yeah. 
and they're saying, oh, there's still all this other stuff that's moving in a similar way. It does make you go. And you know, you know, someone in the, high up in the military is going to be sort of like, how can we like, if we're trying to keep this a secret, mm -hmm. how do we keep it a secret? You yeah. know what I mean? And it's sort of like, you've got a bunch of people and uh, propaganda is real. Like we don't need to like, we don't need to like fear eyes on that. Propaganda is real. Mm -hmm. um, they don't want you to know about sort of like, I mean, especially in America, they don't want you to know about all, how good healthcare is in other countries. They're talking no. about, they're talking about how bad healthcare is in Canada, mm -hmm. how, how bad healthcare is in, in, mm -hmm. in Europe. They talk about all this shit. And they talk about like, you know, London is a, uh, is, what was it? Is it's a, it's under siege yeah. from from uh, Islamic, you know, <laughs> fundamentalism, and it's like all that sort of stuff. So like, we know that propaganda is real, and is, mm -hmm. especially in, in the United States, like a lot. So the idea that like, <laughs> if any of this is even somewhat true, like I don't know. Yeah. At the end of the day, like I. Do I have an opinion on what the balloon, you know, the balloon was? No, I don't, because I don't know anything about this. I just know that some shit went down. A bunch of like military jets got scrambled, and it was a balloon. And I'm like, okay, a bunch of jets got scrambled because mm -hmm. it was a balloon. We have the most. You guys have the most expensive scanning technology that's ever been devised by mm -hmm. human brains, and you can't differentiate a balloon from anything else. And I'm like, hmm, okay, cool. The only thing I think about that is I know that guys like to flex and also like to fly their planes. Sure. And I definitely think that there could be a level of humans going oh watch out to get in the planes we should fly them let's go look at the balloon oh and i'm not saying but there is also an element of there's a big like fucking checklist mm -hmm. of things that someone some some yeah, boffin needs like, to do who doesn't get the flight of planes yes who does it who then goes okay mm -hmm. i'm authorizing this as someone who doesn't get the flight of planes i don't really give a fuck if you go out or not yes that's true and it's a waste of fuel and it's a waste of money yeah and it's, not, it's not top gun but it's jump in the cockpit and yeah, fly yeah, off like, you know? like, da, 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 yeah no. but sometimes you'd be surprised so on one hand, yes, there is a lot more to it than someone just being sure. like, I'm going to fly. But at the same time, you'd sometimes be surprised by how little like oversight there is. And it's like, yeah, do you think we can get away with it? Yeah, we can get away with it. That being said... Well, it's more what the balloon could have... could mm -hmm. Have uh... have on it. Well, I mean, again, like we... Mm -hmm. I didn't see it. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? No, they didn't. They weren't like, mm -hmm. look at this balloon. It was a mm -hmm. sort of like... They were like, it's a balloon, by the way. Ciao. And I was <laughs> yeah. like, I was like, okay. Okay, fair um, enough. And I'm like, mm -hmm. I don't really, I can't really sit here on the internet and bash my hands mm -hmm. and be like, that's a lie, that's a lie. I don't mm -hmm. fucking know. I, and I've got no proof. I'm not going to go fly out there, for fuck's sake. Oh, yeah, Devi Chan. I 100% agree with you. Mm -hmm. Also, hi, Harry. It's nice to see you. Um, and um, I'm sorry that you're an alien, but I'm sure you look great. But yeah, no, I completely agree with you. Fred was saying basically that that's propaganda that is given to Americans that like our healthcare system is better because you don't have to wait as long. Yeah. And it's like, but you can always get your treatment and it costs you nothing. So, yeah. Yeah. Anyway, that's not the point. But the point, but the point is, propaganda is real. Yes. And they do want to basically give their population a version of the events that basically mm -hmm. suits whatever they want to do. And if, if I, in the in the crazy, I couldn't quite imagine it to be real, but it does seem to be becoming more and more real mm -hmm. as time goes on. That there are aliens, and there are alien mm -hmm. crafts, and the American government has known about it for a while, and they do have stuff and all that sort of stuff and mm -hmm. there is non-human biologics and all that sort of shit um and they do want to keep it secret mm -hmm. you best believe they're going to be like coming up with a million and five different reasons why it's uh you know why it's not real oh my god haha ha, you believe in the aliens what a lot what a joke you know what i mean mm -hmm. it's like that's this it makes sense it, it tracks it does um we've also got this one which is a former u.s intelligence agent david grush while testifying to congress in the ufo hearings just scared the crap out of me Let's I think this is the out. human one again. Oh, is it? Yeah. Oh, maybe. Let's see. So there has been activity by, by alien or non non human technology, and or beings that has caused harm to humans. Uh, I can't get into the specifics in a, an open environment, but at least the activity that I personally witnessed, and I have to be very careful here because uh, you don't, you know, they tell you never to acknowledge tradecraft, right? So. What I personally witnessed, myself and my wife, was very disturbing. Okay. So yeah, that there... sounds like some sexy probe time. That does. Deeply disturbing. This is the thing. Also, I'm not sure what the, what's, the, what's the wife doing. <laughs> what? <laughs> That's what I'm thinking. Is she flying what the planes too? Wife doing that? If she's sorry, why isn't she here? Maybe, Bring the wife out. Maybe the wife was banging the alien, oh. right? Maybe they were hitting a little like. A little like. A uh, little. A little uh... And he sees it and he's like, Great Scott! That's deeply disturbing. Of course you'd be like, 
So uh, he wants to be the sandwich in the Audrey. Uh, the idea that UFOs and aliens isn't frightening to me, but the idea they could exist and that they could be doing harm to humanity is very concerning. No, I'll probably have nightmares for the next three months now. All right, oh, well, Ed, Ed, you need a therapist, babe. Ed needs to chill out. You know what I mean? Ed, mm -hmm. Ed, it's not that. It's not that bad. Ed, they're mm -hmm. not going to come get you. Don't worry. And then we've Ed's also like, got. They're um, going to probe me. Oh wait, it's non-biologics again. Extraterrestrials. Something I can't discuss in public setting. Um, okay, I can't ask when you think this occurred. Yeah, yeah this is biologics again. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, honestly, to me, it's just kind of the entire situation is a, it's almost mm -hmm. impossible to like swallow this pill because it's like the thing that this I isn't, this isn't like random people. This isn't a podcast. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. This is like really high up i mean those jets cost a lot of money they gotta trust you a lot to fly that shit you know what i mean like you've got to, you've got to be pretty uh pretty like do we know what long-term exposure to g-forces does to the human mind yeah, well. you know back in the day when they put women on train trains and they thought that their uteruses were gonna fall out and stuff maybe that's been happening you know his brain's been like he's been g-force g6 weighed one too many times but no i <laughs> i truly think it is very interesting I'm very strange. The fact that this story, like, the, the, I grew up in the era of, like, shitty newspapers yeah. saying that woman, her son was turned into a fish finger or whatever. We grew up with, in the crop circles era, in the, my cows getting X -Files, sliced the truth in is out there. Like, all of those stupid stories were coming out, right? So, I have a very strong disposition towards being very distrustful of alien stories. Of I've heard too many. But the fact that this story won't die over the course of like genuinely like 20 years is quite crazy. And it's also, it's just to me that it's, it's, it's not fucking Dave Down Road. It's, it, these are- We start besmirching Dave's Well, knowledge. Dave Down Road chats a lot of shit. I mean, this <laughs> is stuff, okay? Um, mm -hmm. Yeah, we've got one more video um, if, we, if we fancy. Um, um. At one point, you had said that there, 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 there uh, has been harmful activity or aggressive activity. Has any of the activity uh, been aggressive, been um, oh, yeah, hostile? He's, not, he's alien. He's a in lizard. your reports, that's a lizard. Uh, Mask I on know loose. of multiple colleagues of mine that got physically injured, and uh, the activity. And I got to by by UAPs or by by people within the the federal government. Both. Okay, yeah. so yeah. there has been activity by, by alien or non non human technology, and or beings that has caused harm to humans. Uh, I can't get into the specifics in a, an open environment, but at least the activity that I personally witnessed, and I have to be very careful here because uh, yes. you don't, you know, they tell you never to acknowledge trait. So, so yeah. I think, personally, we are way too invested in the, are there individuals, are they flying onto the planet, and do they mean me harm? Mm -hmm. Like, if there is alien technology, let's say, that has been found, or, or even just witnessed, that really should be more of the story than me and my wife had a sexual trust with this alien. Like, that doesn't actually <laughs> matter. Do you know what I mean? Like, I feel like when people are like, was there a little dude inside? I'm like, realistically, no. There should not have been a little dude inside. How the fuck is that? Like, time still exists for aliens, let's say. Mm -hmm. Why would you fly all the way to Earth? All of our stories about aliens that started in our solar system made sense. You could fly to Earth in a few days or a few sure. years or whatever. Sure. Depending on what the solar system is doing and what planet you're coming from. If you're coming from outside the solar system, somewhere else in the freaking galaxy, well, you're not you're not gonna fly there yourself, are you? That would well, be wild. We don't know. We have no idea. This is the thing: is that we we like to think we're, we're super smart and we know exactly what's going. Oh, we don't I know. Do. They I might know. have they might have stargates for all we fucking know. They might have mm -hmm. like fucking instant mm -hmm. like boop, like like fucking uh, Battlestar Galactica where they just mm -hmm. pop in and out. Well, that's distance. that's what Ninka Kitty said. The level yeah. of technology required would essentially to travel those sorts of distances at like light speed would essentially be magic like well, to us yes yes but then we don't know how far away that is we don't know mm -hmm. if that's a hundred years more advanced mm -hmm. than us we don't know if it's like a thousand years more advanced mm -hmm. than us you gotta remember like like fucking what is it like uh when was the first fucking um flight was it like 80 years ago the first yeah, it was fucking the 20s human... yeah when the wright brothers was it the, was it... oh yeah no it wasn't the 40s we had a plane to wait 
So what was happening? When was the Wright no, Brothers? No, kind of in the 20s. Hmm, when were the Wright Brothers? Maybe 1908? Oh, the 1904. Wright... Oh, it was really that long ago. Um, I was like, it can't be the 20s. That's wrong, but... The Wright Brothers' first flight was, yeah, December 17th, 1903. Oh, man, three and eight are so similar. So we are we are just over, we're like 120 years mm -hmm. um, with, with flight, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Like, And then, so we've, we've gone from, like, 120 years ago, we got, like, 10 feet off the ground for 30 seconds, and now, like, there's fucking, we got people floating around space mm -hmm. in the International Space Station. Another 120 years, we don't know whether that might be, you know... I mean, we are discovering new physics all the time and stuff like that. I don't know, it's just kind of crazy. Like, we know so little. Yeah. Also, new superconductor today. New superconductor. We may have a good superconductor. Yeah. That would be exciting. So they got a room temperature, mm -hmm. I think room pressure um, superconductor, which basically means... Um, well, you had a stat earlier, Em. It was the equivalent... The amount of electricity lost because of bad wiring or yeah. like bad conducting on mm -hmm. wires was the equivalent of running... Three, three nuclear power plants. It, so this was in America. So the amount of energy elect, like from electricity mm -hmm. which is lost in the transfer of that electricity is at like its current rate is the equivalent of running three nuclear power stations 24-7. Yeah. That's just in America. So which they crazy, were trying right? to say, ooh, the previous attempt at a superconductor was a massive flop, and all of the previous ones have been a flop. Yeah, they've been, yeah. But this one isn't a flop. Mm -hmm. So we'll see, because obviously, in the fight against climate, climate change, much greater electric efficiency would be very good. Um, but I don't want to distract before we got to aliens. Aliens! Um, but yeah, we got this as well, which is pretty interesting, Grush. Yeah. Mr. Chairman, uh, ranking members and congressmen, uh, thank you. I'm happy to be here. This is an important issue, and I'm grateful for your time. My name is David Charles Grush. I was an intelligence officer for 14 years, in the, both in the U.S. Air Force, uh, both active duty Air National Guard and Reserve, at the rank of major, and most recently from 2021 to 2025, or excuse me, 2023, uh, at the Please, National Spatial Intelligence Agency, NGA, uh, at the GS-15 civilian level, which is uh, the military equivalent of a full bird colonel. I was my agency's co-lead in unidentified anomalous phenomena and transmedium object analysis, uh, as well as reporting to the me. UAP task force, UAPTF, uh, and eventually, once it was established, uh, the All Domain Anomaly Resolution Office, ARO. I became a whistleblower through a PPD-19 urgent concern filing in uh, May 2022 uh, with the Intelligence Community Inspector General. Uh, following concerning reports from multiple esteemed and credentialed current and former military intelligence community again, individuals you know I mean? that the U.S. government the is operating yeah, day, with man. secrecy pooping all night about this. Yes. Everyone's congressional oversight uh, away, guys. with regards to UAPs. My testimony is based on information I've been given by individuals with a long-standing track record of legitimacy and service to this country. <laughs> many of whom also have shared compelling evidence in the form of photography, official documentation, and classified oral testimony to myself and many co my various colleagues. I have taken every step I can to corroborate this evidence over a period of four years while I was with the UAP task force <laughs> and do my due diligence on the individual sharing it. Uh, this is because of these steps, I believe strongly uh, in the importance of bringing this information before you. I am driven by a commitment of both uh, to truth and transparency, rooted in our inherent duty to uphold the United States Constitution and protect the American people. I'm asking Congress to hold our government to this standard and thoroughly investigate these claims. But as I stand here under oath now, I am speaking to the facts as I've been told them. In the U.S. Air Force, in my National Reconnaissance Office, NRO, Reservist Capacity, I was a member of the UAP Task Force from 2019 to 2021. I served at the NRO Operations Center on the... In 2019, the UAP Task Force Director asked me to identify all special access programs and controlled access programs, mm -hmm. also known as SAPs and CAPs, uh, we needed to satisfy our congressionally mandated mission, and we were direct report at the time to the DEPSEC-DEF. 
At the time, due to my extensive executive level intelligence support duties, I was cleared to literally all uh, relevant compartments and in a position of extreme trust, both in my military and civilian capacities. Are they fucked up putting you in a position uh, of trust? I was trust? informed in yeah, the course of my official it. duties of a multi-decade uh, UAP we crash retrieval and reverse them. engineering program. Uh, to which I was denied access to those additional read-ons when I uh, requested it. I made the decision, based on the data I collected, to report this information to my superior, superiors and multiple inspectors general, and in effect becoming a whistleblower. As you know, I've suffered retaliation for my decision, uh, but I am hopeful that my actions will ultimately lead uh, to a positive outcome of uh, increased transparency. Uh, thank you, and I'm happy to answer your questions. So that was his opening statement. Yeah. Um, so yeah, he basically kind of says, I was informed in the course of my official duties of a multiple uh, decade UAP crash retrieval and reverse engineering program. But why do they keep crashing? Imagine you've flown all the fucking way. Yeah. This is why I don't think Isn't there's it? anyone inside it, right? Because let's say they're flying in. I think it's drones as well. And they're crashing. Yeah. Right? That has to be deliberate. Well, You're I... just going, yeet. I think that multicellular intelligent life is going to be pretty rare. And I think if any alien came across us and found us and was sort mm -hmm. they would, they'd be like, holy shit. Like, imagine if we came across a bunch of like, uh, like the uh, Victorian era people when we we're flying around in space, we'd be like, holy shit. Like, that's crazy. So I, it might be drones. Mm -hmm. You know, it might be, mm -hmm. it might be really fucking hard to transverse or transverse that entire distance. It, you know, fast and light mm -hmm. technology might actually be really hard and it might be, um, drones, or it might be, I don't know, scary sci-fi fucking biological robot drone thing. Is there like some sort of like... Cylons, but they got man inside. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Man and robot come together. I, know, it's... No, I mean, of course, we could go from anything from... Oh, sure. It's a short journey with quantum entanglement. They yep. just literally go like... And then out they come, crashing directly into Earth for some reason. Yeah. Like, the thing is, obviously we can't assume what they're like i'm looking at it from a human perspective where i would be curious interested in these yes. other people what they're up to whatever but aliens could be driven by different stuff Gua'ul Gua'ul, ship. oh yeah fucking yeah. the egyptian pyramids i've oh, been it's there a, it's a Landing cylon, sites. cylon meat ship don't disrespect my pyramids <laughs> someone built those um but obviously it could be anything from quantum entanglement to big long flight you know mm -hmm. to maybe they got a freaking big old ship yeah three short distances of space away where they're just sending stuff out being like oh what's over there and obviously we do the thing where we crash drones into planets but we do that because we know that we can't land on it because the planet will destroy whatever it is so yeah. when we're like oh let's have a look at jupiter we just go yeet mm -hmm. and then we go oh we got Three minutes of us falling into Jupiter before the fucking, yeah. you know, gravity crushed it or whatever. Um, breaking distance, they're coming in at light speed. Exactly. Let's say, like, I just think that in the case that you're doing that, obviously you're not expecting to get that technology back. But the idea that you're, like, just dumping it. Well, I think that's kind of crazy. It, well, again, it might be it might be just us um, being like, well, they're so much more advanced than us. There's no way they can make mistakes, or there's no way their technology can go wrong, or you know, like if they're, yeah, if they're... But it keeps going wrong, a multi-decade, like get it right. But yeah, it's kind of mm -hmm. crazy. At, at the end of the day, there's no proof of anything. No. Like, and at the end of the day, I don't really need proof to mm -hmm. have a, an opinion. <laughs> you know what I mean? Um, get duped. Jupiter, probably. <laughs> but um, it, I don't know. Part of me is like, it, this is like, it's just kind of crazy. It's crazy. It is mad. <laughs> and I, I know a lot of people want to kind of like reserve, reserve their emotions and stuff like that because it is a little bit sort of like a very hard pill to swallow. It's like government, it's government be reverse engineering technology. Like they're pretty much saying we've been reverse engineering mm -hmm. technology. Not pretty well kind though. Of insane. Yeah. Well, I mean, where did the superconductor come from? Emily? They dropped a superconductor on us. <laughs> Deeds gifted us. Sub to the English gentleman, English gentleman. Welcome, welcome back to my life. Welcome back to the way of the Dragonflex. Get duped. And yeah, I mean, I guess the the, mo the most sensible uh, sort of like um, face saving 
opinion to have is sort of like, <laughs> well, you know, we don't know anything, so uh, it's probably nothing. But at the same time, I'm just sort Fred of like... Fred is like, it's something. Well, I'm like, it has to be something at the very least. Whether, whether mm. it's like China or Russia, mm. not Russia, they can't do believe Ukraine. that I'm a skeptic in this scenario. Well, it's not, I, again, I mm. think, I think the, the reasonable position to take is that there's something going on, whether it's America, like um, top secret America government technology shit's happening, where they've actually figured out how to fucking like bounce around on gravity bubbles or whatever the fuck, you know, I don't even know. But, um, you know, they got, they got the just gravity- God's farts. Yeah, they got the gravity trampoline going and they're just like bouncing around. Uh, or whether it's alien, I don't know, man. It's just, it's kind of mad. Or whether it's basically a, uh, a really sort of like elaborate subterfuge to figure out who's uh, not trustworthy or not. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. The whole thing is such a crazy, like, I don't, I don't know. Like, why would they crash into us? It's the same way that I, I did see Harry talking about, like, aliens friggin' sucking cows dry of their juice. You, do, you don't need to fly to Earth to get cow juice. No. You and this, this is the issue, is that it mm. has, the, the entire conversation has been marred by a bunch of people who mm -hmm. have been like, I could be quite popular if I say I've been abducted and been probed. And then you got like, then that becomes a thing. Mm -hmm. Then Arizona becomes a huge, like a hot pot, a hot spot for like people going and being sort of like the aliens that would like little crystals and shit like that. The aliens are communicating with me through the crystals. My alien husband has told me that uh, I should always uh, only use my left hand to eat mm -hmm. butter, you know? Mm -hmm. I don't know, like crazy shit. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. It's 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 hard to have a conversation about this because it is so crazy because we make fun of it so much because people are crazy. People are mad mm -hmm. and they will say shit. Uh -huh. And that's what I'm saying is like on one hand, I'm like doubt. But on the other hand, I'm like, well, there has been a certain amount of information that has gotten out, mm -hmm. which does feel realistic. And the stories haven't really changed. But I am confused at the idea of aliens attacking us. Huh? Like what? But you're still alive? Well, it can't be that bad. And then simultaneously, the moose DNA slash pilot that they discovered. What's the deal with that? Like, there's a lot. And then they, why do they keep crashing everywhere? I don't understand. We can't even catch a balloon. No. We cannot capture a balloon. But they keep crashing into Nova Scotia. Make that make sense, you know? And it's not so, just the, the American mm -hmm. government either. Like, apparently, China's been, uh, been like, all over this as well. And... It's kind of crazy. It's it's kind of mm -hmm. insane. Aliens confirmed. I mean, at the very least, they have at least th these three dudes have at, at the very mm -hmm. least said yes. There are there we have seen shit that is unexplainable <laughs> with our current level yeah. of understanding. Which that is, is confirmed. That's what I find so that angle of it is what I find so genuinely interesting. Like genuinely compelling mm -hmm. is like, well, what is this technology? Where is it coming from? I don't need to know about the small amount of sperm you found. You know what I mean? Like, don't get me wrong, it is interesting. And maybe it was a whole guy, and maybe he was flying. He was like, oh boy, I've crashed. Oh, geez, how embarrassing. Maybe. Yeah. But, also, or maybe could... an alien left a little fucking alien hair in there. Or it could just be someone fucking pulled the wrong lever on a, on a, mm -hmm. on a spaceship. The, the fucking thing donked him in the head, mm -hmm. and we were like, oh, it's attacking him. And it's like, mm -hmm. no, 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 that's just how that opens. He just stood in the wrong place. Um, but yeah, no, there are aliens, right? That's mm -hmm. the kind of thing. The mathematical probability of there being another mm -hmm. civilization out there mm -hmm. that communicate, that yeah. have music. When we talk about aliens, we're talking about that we're interacting. Yes, with. we're talking about because like we're talking about um, your, your 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 visitors from outer space. You know what I mean? Exactly. We're talking about your greys. Mm -hmm. We're talking about your your cybermen. Do you know what I mean? What, 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 what we're not talking about is five galaxies over. Whether fucking uh, Dave is talking more shit. You know what I mean? Some oh, alien. God Dave. damn it, Dave. Yeah. Like, mathematically, there are aliens. Mm -hmm. um, mm, yeah, and I think the only way that you could really argue that is just from a religious perspective. Yeah. Of like, no, God gave us the touch, and that's fine if that's how you want to feel about it. You know, you've got to live your life. But I think realistically, if you b believe in, you know, evolution and life coming about on the planet Earth as a sort of coincidence... Um, then, well, you know, Adam, when God was like, Adam, have a bit of brain. And he was like, oh, oh, oh what have you done? <laughs> oh, you give me up. anxiety. <laughs> Look what you've done to this monkey. I've given him anxiety. Um, I mean, that's the thing with me is that the Milky Way contains between 100 billion and 400 billion stars. So let's go through the middle. Let's say 200, 200 billion stars, right? Mm -hmm. And let's say conservatively that each uh, star has at least three planets. So then you've got 600 billion planets. And let's say that 0 0.01 percent of those uh, planets um could 
be habitable, then you've got like still a huge number. Do you know what I mean? It's like the numbers are so mind-bogglingly mm. big. And one Chris Diana, thank you for the follow. Thank you. Um, the my, the numbers are so mind-bogglingly. <laughs> bogglingly, I can't even talk. Bogglingly. Bogglingly. Mm -hmm. Wow, that's a really hard word. It is. Um, that it just isn't really even worth a six. Mm -hmm. so, so zero point. Did you hear? Uh, b beloved Christian of. viewers, put your fingers in your ears because I'm not trying to upset you. Um, but did you hear that apparently the rib is a bad translation and it's supposed to be cut in half? Yeah, I did hear that. Yeah. So, yeah, you know, the whole God made Adam out of clay and then made Eve out of rib. Yeah, rib is side and they, they, they think they mean half rather than specifically rib, which is interesting. Um, it makes more sense. Yes, it's a terrible translation. Yeah. And it does make so much more yeah, sense. Yeah, it makes more sense. A rib. Yeah. A rib? Um, mm. But yeah, like so like 0.01% of 600 billion is still 60 million. And then 0.01% um, of 60 million is still 6,000. And then 0.01% of 6,000 is still uh, 0 0.6. So, <laughs> do you know what I mean? Like, yeah. it's one of those things where the, the, the galaxy is so mm -hmm. fucking big that there's going to be... I mean, there might be another fucking... Ah, it's big. I mean, bear in mind as well that you said each sun has at least three planets. And it's going to be more than it's that. It's going to be more, you know. No, don't get me wrong. I'm not religious. Therefore, I'm obviously not going to buy into a talking snake, let's say. But I'm just saying that... Or a floaty man in cloud. I think it's interesting as we look at our world and how it has been impacted by the stories that we tell each other especially the stories of our religions. And for example, I, as a woman, do find it interesting that I may have been misogyny my whole life, largely because somebody went, half, my wife's a bitch. Side, <laughs> we'll make it rib. <laughs> One rib. <laughs> but also translations are really hard. So, you know, you we're trying our best. Talk to the me. only real floating man in a cloud is Noel when he's Oceanites. <laughs> I mean, the only the only way um, the whole one rib thing would make sense if men had like more ribs on one side than the mm. other. We don't. Or if ladies were extremely tiny. Yeah. I'm not one rib tiny. No. It's I really had a funny. whole rack of ribs. All I'm gonna say. Oh, well, the only thing I have to say mm -hmm. is that um uh well uh, we uh, I have aliens now, so your book's fucking wrong. Mm. Don't care what book, it's wrong. So I, I mean. Torah, Bible, Quran. As well, you're gonna end up with a situation I know where aliens and any of that shit. Well, those are all essentially the same book. Yeah, they are the same book. They just, they've just got addendums. Some quid pro quos. Um, but it, you're always going to get pushback from, like, religious people for whom, like, the earth being God's main creation, you're already hitting them with a few hot question marks when you look at the entire universe. When there's billions of planets and billions of stars and billions of galaxies. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Um, then... Lot you are always going to end up with a bit of a challenge to sell the story of like we were the chosen ones everything else like why would you even make the whole universe yeah if it's just for us i yeah. can't even get to most of it can't even so, i can't i can't even live mm, on most of the planet on most of this planet yeah like but, majority of it is ocean but you know if you go fuck it let's extrapolate that once you then start going oh yeah there's also aliens and they're also as smart as we are and they've also been running around doing stuff and they were also the most important creatures on their planet and all of that kind of stuff you know the same way that we Do they have their own jesus ours. yeah probably their I mean, own muhammad their own fucking I'd be buddha surprised if if other cultures didn't have religions no, of course. i think most probably um i think the horror of realizing you're gonna die pushes everyone in a direction you know more, more than likely <laughs> there uh, for every for every sentient fucking species mm. in the world there's gonna be at least a four, like four religions you know what i mean <laughs> Um, well. Yeah, like no, it, I, would, I feel yeah. like I feel like religion is mm. one of those things that just ends up happening. Yeah. A bit like two eyes in the front, next to the brain. That's always gonna. No matter what planet you go to, it doesn't, you're not gonna find an alien that has two eyes coming out the fucking knees. Do you know what I mean? It's just not gonna happen. It's always gonna be eyes front for depth, or sideways for like more field of view, right near the brain. Mm. You're never gonna get like a big fucking optical nerve going all the way down to the knees. Yeah, it's just messy. It's just messy. Um, That's why someone said if. Mm. Um, we found a bunch of, uh, do you guys think these newly discovered Earth-like planets could have life similar, uh, similarly to our planet? And I'm going to say, in my opinion, if there is life in other planets, which there might be, um, there also might not be, um, that is probably going to look very familiar. Um, life, evolution, pretty much, we figured it out. Evolution was sort of like, that works. It's the most efficient one. Mm. Four legs, generally. <laughs> you know what we're going to get, baby. We're getting crabs! 
Crabs in space. Yeah. Uh, well, There's it, more think, than likely crabs. Yeah, crabs everywhere. I think... Uh, that kind of makes me uncomfortable a tiny bit. I think realistically what we're looking at, if we're looking at other animals... Yeah, because most things aren't bipedal, right? Most things are on four legs. You know, your dogs, your cats, your crocodiles. Um, so... I mean, I think it's unlikely that you would see life on a gas planet, but what we have to bear in mind is that every time we look in the sea, we go, ah, that's horrible. Yeah. Because the sea, sea's got aliens in it because they evolved in completely different stresses and pressures, right? I mean, we're still and trying so, to dig through the European crust to see if there's, like, the ocean in there has any life in it. It's going to be nasty. It's going to be pale. It's going to be like... Nasty little worms. Little shrimp, like worms and shrimp Ugh. and stuff like that. Yeah, little... And they're going to have no eyes. And it's going to be like, where's your eyes? So, like, obviously, there is a lot of things that are life. And life is not just dudes, right? Like, life oh, yeah. is like, in, you know, it's germs. It's viruses. Well, actually, is viruses alive? They're not no, really they're not alive. alive. No. Um, we don't consider viruses no. alive. No. They're still fucking doing stuff, but I don't mean viruses. Retract the virus, but it's a little tardigrade, you know? Um, <laughs> I know of a Tic Tac shaped thing that crashed at the bottom of the ocean. Isn't there a guy who keeps saying that something crashed somewhere and he wants to go investigate it? Is that what you're referring to? Bacteria is, is life. Guy? Uh, virus yes. is not bacteria. They no. are not life. That's what I'm saying. Bacteria. One of the germs. I meant bacteria. But you know what I mean? Life is a variety of things. And there is a good... Fucking... Are you talking about Stargate? I right, talk to Fred. I've done. Um, oh! <laughs> oh! I just realized what C2 was talking about. Oh. My God. Everyone's favorite flat billionaires. But, right, I think that there are a lot of... I mean, we're even potentially have been looking at Mars, that back in the day, Mars may have had the conditions that would be correct mm -hmm. for life. And also Mars may well have had um, amino acids. And as we currently think life began, amino acids clonking into each other a bunch is sort of in the primordial yeah. ooze is sort of the first idea. My so friend mind, bought herself the Titanic Lego set. She's also bought a submarine set to finish the display. No bullshit. Is it like a, That's a, good. a crushed uh, plastic bottle <laughs> of a game controller runs out of it? Just a little bit of really fine dust. Just a little bit of like glitter. Yeah, and a tiny game controller. <laughs> the, yeah, um, but what I was going to say, so what I'm saying is if the next planet over from us, which obviously is still in the habitable zone around the sun, because, you know, once you start getting too close or too far away, you're fucking everything up anyway. But if that planet could potentially have bacteria or uh, have potentially had the starting point for life, but it went shit. Mm -hmm. You know, you've got to look at it a little bit like hatching an egg where sometimes it's not going to go well and sometimes it is going to go well. And I definitely think that there is likely, well, there's going to be life out there. Whether the life is as smart as we are at the same time as we are, because like, let's say you're really smart, but the atmosphere blows off your planet. It's not much you can do. No. You know? And when I say really smart, I mean, like, anything from I've invented a hammer to I've invented a computer. To I've you know, made a song. To I've made... Yeah, that's what I mean. Like, whether it be early tool users or, you know, us now sitting on the internet, it's all very smart. Uh, you know? There is a... Hey, Shay, Mr. 54 months. Thank you so much. You're uh, a legend. Uh, Ninka Kitty says, there's mm -hmm. a hypothesis that life on Earth, as we know it, is a fluke and required pretty specific conditions to happen. Yes. Yes. And also, that's, that's, that's a, as much of a... We don't really understand uh, abiogenesis. Mm -hmm. um, abiogenesis is basically... Uh, it's alive! It's still a mystery mm -hmm. to us, you know yeah. what I mean? But we do know that like um, mm -hmm. we amino acids are pretty common. Mm -hmm. um, oils are pretty common. Mm -hmm. And once you get amino acids and, and oils that interact with each other mm -hmm. and form cells. just And enough heat and, and light heat and, and energy. and mm -hmm. Yeah, it's, um, it's all a theory. Yep. I mean, you're saying theory. It's not a theory. It's a hypothesis. Yes, because a theory can be proved to be a true. Theory, and a theory still, is like basically akin is to a fact. Theory. Yeah. Yes. Theory and fact are kind of synonymous. If you, but if we're talking scientific, hypothesis is basically, I have some evidence that points me in this direction. Kind yeah, of. just give me a vibe. Put a bunch of chemicals in the glass, hit it with lightning, and amino acids popped up. And that's very interesting, but then it makes you go, well, maybe it's much easier to get amino acids and much harder to get life. Mm -hmm. And like... The or reality maybe it just requires is, requires time, which is yeah. like something that we don't, we can't but speed up. But that's what up. I'm saying is, we were thinking, oh, 
Mars may have had life or had the chance to have life, but then the fucking atmosphere blew off. The atmosphere blew off because it might have just been because there was no plate tectonics happening. It might have just been bugs. Mm. You know what I mean? Mars might have just Mm. been. Can I be your son? No, No. unfortunately, I am. I got it on Marnie. I got no. I it fell off, so I can't do it. You know what I mean? No, Uh, didn't they detect bacteria in the atmosphere on Venus? No, we uh, that was um. What you're talking about is basically uh, they didn't detect bacteria. Gas. They detected the gas that can only really be made by bacteria, but we don't know whether the uh, instruments were detecting the right thing or not. So that's more of a hot question mark. Mm -hmm. It's all fallen off. It fell off. It's gone. I pulled it Um, too hard, it fell off. (laughs) Um. Um, But yeah, no. So the situation is we, we start just to get into like bigger conversations where we don't know what we don't know how life came to be we could be looking at mars saying oh my god is that an amino acid it could have been an amino acid clonked off earth way back in the day that's called panspermia (laughs) but you know if an asteroid hit us and a bit flew off and hit mars we could be like whoa and we're looking at our own history Mm -hmm. there it's possible Possible. not saying it's definite i'm just saying like we don't know how likely it is and we also don't know how likely it is that life would ever get beyond like a few what? Fuck gay community. Whoa! I kiss you, bro. I'm gonna find you. I'm gonna kiss you. <laughs> I'm gonna kiss you. Gonna love it. I'm gonna um, kiss you on the on the forehead and tuck uh, you in bed and it's tell gonna be you okay, love. Baby, it's gonna be fine. Um, fuck you too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, but like, J.K. No one loves him. It could be any of those things, and this is the challenge when, especially when you're talking about like aliens, is you're just getting into like bigger and bigger and bigger yeah. conversations that have fewer and fewer answers and are interesting to discuss and to think about, and I really like it, but like, yeah, there is a good chance, there is not even a small chance, there is a good chance that there are other beings yeah. alive right now, With the shit. also super smart, who have a tic tac, who are flying it into the earth. It's, it's, not it's never, it's never. There's never been more evidence pointing to that being the mm-hmm. case, right? Um, I'm not saying that that is yeah, that, 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 that you should suddenly be mm-hmm. like the truth out there. I believe in a tic- or the almighty tic tac. Mm-hmm. What I am saying is that like, it's fucking interesting. It's great. It, it's mm-hmm. that tic tac's fucking me up. I'm gonna be honest. It's I'm... finally shedding a light on sort of like stuff that like. I mean, they've known about this for fucking yonks. They're like, yeah, like shit comes down from space. It's like motionless mm. in a hurricane and fucks off back to space. Like, how are you doing that? And like, what they're like, oh, oh do we have anything that could do that? And they're like, no, we li- even if we wanted to, we couldn't do that. We and, literally cannot do that. And it's like, that. ah, right. How do you explain that? Yeah. It's like, is China secret? If China were, then mm. it would be, you know, they would be able to... I don't know. The implications of like technology like that existing from another nation. Mm-hmm. I mean, you know, you know, it's not like Indonesia. Yeah, they're not. Yeah, India's setting rockets up in the space but i don't think they're quite there yet yeah you know I mean? and that's kind of the thing is then it comes back around to america spends the most money they have the they have the mm-hmm. resources the time the people if america can't do it who the fuck can do it you know no one else is coming up i mean russia keep just marching up and down saying look we can still step real good and i'm like well they're not doing shit um and it might be a north sentinel <laughs> island situation mm-hmm. where they're like, oh, we can't go and interfere with these humans because we don't want to mess with their, uh, their maybe their moral, right? Maybe they've got like some sort of like sense of morality. But um, we keep on fucking shooting the shit down. A bit like how we try to send a drone over North Sentinel Island, which has a bunch of uncontacted people on there from mm-hmm. way, you know, we, can't, we don't even know how long. And they're throwing spears at our drones. And we're like, no, we just want to look at you. And they're like, fuck off. Fuck off, I don't want to be perceived. And we're doing the same thing. We're yeah. like, fuck off. And we're shooting down their drones. You know yeah. what I mean? Which is also definitely possible. And it could be it could be drones. Mm-hmm. It could be horrible bacteria drones, like the fucking ships from, from Battlestar Galactica, which are like half uh, machine, the half the meat ship. The meat ship. It could be uh, it could be maybe ju- like jumping from solar system to solar system is mm-hmm. a doddle. You know, it's not actually a big deal. Mm-hmm. Maybe they fold space and then you know what I mean. What's a black knight satellite? I'm good googling. That's, that. I mean, can I hear it? That's that my entire point is that basically we don't know. Um it could be US Maytech. I would be surprised if we had. Scary noise came from outside. Someone just started yeah, yeah, yeah. their. Someone just started their motorbike outside, and it was like, brum, and it sounded very scary. I am gonna shit myself. <laughs> I don't care that that's not real. Like, not not real. I don't care that that's just a picture of space debris, and my brain's doing that thing where it finds patterns where there aren't patterns. That's a ship. They're looking at me, and I hate them. Time to kill! Yee-hoo! Kind of looks like the uh, the androids from... 
what was that movie where with um where they end up on the black hole planet and like twenty years pass? Prometheus. No, I was screaming that... hope, uh, optimistically into the microphone. Not Prometheus. And then he gets off and he watches the video of his kids and he cries. Oh, Interstellar. It's a, it looks like the androids from Interstellar. Uh, yeah, okay. Oh, he has a little cry. Why did you go on the wrong planet first, you idiot? That planet was obviously shit. No one wants to age extremely quickly. Uh, not an android. It's Actually, a robot, age it? extremely slowly. <laughs> and they can't get off it. It's crap. I hate it. That was a shit planet. It's Bye, so have fun. Bring an umbrella. An umbrella. See you. Enjoy B Barbosa. Yeah, do you remember the uh, the robots from Interstellar? Kind of looks like that. I literally don't, and I feel do like I should. I only watched it once, to be honest. No, it's kind of disappointing. It's a good film. Um, let us find out about this shape that we just showed on screen. The Black Light Satellite Conspiracy Theory claims that a spacecraft of extraterrestrial origin is in near polar orbit of the Earth. To this day... Orbit be crazy and NASA though, huh? is covering up its existence and origin. The conspiracy theory combines several unrelated stories into one narrative. A okay, so it's not true. Um, mm -hmm. A photo taken during STS-88 mission claimed by some to show the Black Knight satellite is catalogued by NASA as a photo of space debris and the space journalist James Ogberg, Oberg uh, considers it as probable debris of a thermal blanket confirmed as lost during the mission right so this is not even a joke and unfortunately now i've heard that i'm like oh yeah it does look like a blanket because unfortunately i'm a human um yeah it's a blanket it's just floated off <laughs> and they took a picture and was like look there's my blanket and they're like it's aliens crap you Mate, see imagine losing this your blanket. does show us yeah a little thermal blanket Aww. just blankie. flapping around it's batman it's batman <laughs> I'm Batman. Yeah, I found um, the entire conversation mm -hmm. really fascinating. Mm -hmm. um, obviously, there's a lot to discuss about it, and I, I think a lot of people get kind of like um, you get to, you get two sides of it, right? You get people who sort of like are kind of like, well, let's look at it as if it is real, and like, mm -hmm. what would that mean? Mm -hmm. And then you get a lot of people sort of like, no, shut up, it's not real. Bah. And then that's another fine because it might not be real. It might just be a bunch of shit. These guys might be just three bros pulling the biggest prank of all time. Um, who knows? You know, yeah, it's crazy. But Love it, a bit of attention. But, can't wait to sell a book. You can't deny it. it's entertaining. Mm -hmm. it's, it's I'm also, entertained. I want I want aliens mm -hmm. to be real. I mean, I kind of do. It's kinda I just scary. wish that the aliens made more cohesive sense. Mm. Like, what are they up to? Why are they doing these things? It's weird. Um, yeah. Also, yes, the debris is still up there because it wouldn't really fall down. Hey, posh cap. It, it's gonna it's gonna orbit or not. Also, all of this happening after Amuamua. Amuamua. Do you remember Amuamua? Uh, Amuamua was um. So it will fall down eventually. Amuamua was a um. It's a rock. It was a, it was an asteroid, mm -hmm. as far as we know, uh, mm -hmm. that came into our solar system, and uh, sling. It came. Sorry, yeah. It's the first time we've ever had a big object come into our solar system from outside of it. Um, it was a bit. It was it was long, like mm -hmm. a long boy, which makes no sense. Mm -hmm. And it came in, and it basically slingshotted around uh, the sun. And um, it basically moved. And we're like, why are you doing that? It, yeah, it basically didn't. Stop moving suspiciously. It was, it was moving in a way that mm -hmm. it wasn't supposed to move. And everyone's mm -hmm. very confused. And everyone was sort of like, what's going on here? Right. So Amuamua, water mm -hmm. um, disassociates uh, to produce molecular hydrogen. Into, yeah, so basically the, the right. That's, you know how like the, the comet trail isn't actually like. Bits. It, it's actually being stuff blown off by the yeah. sun. So enter the solar system. Uh, trapped hydrogen gas are released. Comet accelerates. So yeah, basically, Meow. it gets to here mm. and then speeds up, mm -hmm. and that's like supposed to be like not. not but the at the same time, have you ever like, for example, heated up a bottle with a lid on it, and then the lid pops off? Like it, you know. Uh, but people who study asteroids say say are like. We're like, wow, that's that's weird. not supposed to happen. Yeah. So yeah. Um, according to some UFO conspiracies, the Black Knight is an artificial satellite of an extraterrestrial origin that has orbited Earth for approximately 1,003... How the fuck would we know if something had been orbiting Earth for 13,000 years? They have their ways. That they? seems incredibly <laughs> unlikely. It does. The satellite story is most likely a conflation of several disconnected stories about various objects and interpretations. All of them well documented independently, and none of them use the term Black Knight upon their publication. But it's cooler when you give it a cool name. It is cool when um, you give it a cool name. Black Knight is a jumble of completely unrelated stories, reports of unusual science observations, authors promoting fringe ideas, 
classified spy satellites and people over-interpreting photos. These ingredients have been chopped up, stirred together and stewed on the internet into one <laughs> rambling and inconsistent dollop of myth. Well, I think what we can take from that is that the Black Knight conspiracy isn't real. Now, yeah. I've had this really annoying memory that's tingling the back of my brain, which feels relevant. Tell me, tell me. But now I can't remember what it is. And there's... Oh, God, it's so annoying. There is a guy who is, like, quite a... This is just my memory of it. So just... We're trying to discover what the fuck I'm actually remembering here. So follow me. Okay. There's a guy. There's a guy. He's a scientist. He's okay. like a good scientist. He yes. knows what the fuck's up. He's not just some... Not just some dude. Not just some dude with a pet Petri dish. He thinks that some shit fell into the sea. Yeah. And he thinks it's sus. And he wants to go see it. But he can't get the money, right, to go see it. So I was going to be like, this is the film. I'm like, no, I swear it was real. Um, and he was tr he's trying to raise the money and he thinks he's got a bunch of rich people to give him the money to like look off the edge of Indonesia. It's not Ocean Gate again. Oh, God. It's raining so it's, hard. Uh, it's raining very I hard. I can't be dealing with this. It's stressing me out. Does he make a submarine with game, game controllers? No. <laughs> oh, okay, no, okay. No, frick. Oh, crap. Okay, maybe I'll just like look up. I'll just type some words into Google and hope that something actually shows up. Because carpets are washed. Oh my god, what happened? I don't even want to know. When you have to wash the carpet around the children, you know something diabolical is happening. That is all I have to say on the subject. Um. um but yeah. Uh, so yeah. Um, man. Alien. Okay. Aliens confirm chat. I'm just saying. You can't type in like scientist wants to discover the bottom of the ocean because everyone wants to do. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm sorry. So something fell in the sea. Right. He thinks we saw it fall in the sea. He wants to go look. Everyone's like, girl, why do you want to look in the sea so bad? He's like, I know where it crashed. I want to see. And he thinks it's aliens. Right, okay. I, it doesn't, doesn't ring a bell. Yeah, I'm not saying it does. I'm just no, saying, no, no, no. I'm, I'm just saying. Mm -hmm. I, I... Um, he did it already, right? What's this? This is going to be a fucking scam. What's this? What is this? Metallic marbles from ocean floor may be alien tech. Harvard scientist. <gasps> Three weeks ago. Yes, this is the guy. Is this it? Avi Loeb. Avi Loeb. Yes, ball in sea. And he's not a lunatic. Look oh, him up. Maybe okay. maybe they'll say he is a lunatic. Check. Let's look. Avi Loeb. Avi Loeb. Uh, Abraham Avi Loeb is an Israeli-American theoretical physicist who works on astrophysics and cosmology. Loeb is in the Frank B. Be uh, Bard bed. Junior professor professor of science at Harvard University. See, he's a real not a lunatic. Sixty one years old, Harvard oh, University. Peachy, that's so nice. Um, See, search for alien meteor underground. He thinks that there, there's actually stuff in the sea. So the low sea ball. The relics you know of the first interstellar meteor are thought to lie at the bottom of the Pacific Ocean. Yes. Last week, one controversial scientist and his team sure claimed to have found them deep beneath the Pacific Ocean. Mute. Echo. Mute. Yeah, going to swarm by. Sorry. I did it. I did sorry. it. Sorry. What have I got open? Is it orange stream? stream? Oh, my bad. Um, sorry. Mm. Okay. The relics of the first interstellar meteor are thought to lie at the bottom of the, of the Pacific Ocean. Last week, one controversial scientist and his team claimed to have found them. Deep beneath the Pacific Ocean in an inky abyss roughly a mile underwater, a curious black and silver beast is stirring up mud. With, uh, with a spotted metallic body and wriggling umbilicals uh, of purple rope. I rope. think that that's just the thing they're looking with. Uh, to the regions, I was going to say, what the fuck? Uh, to the region's own eccentric deep sea fauna, it might resemble a kind of rectangular stingray. This is the world's first interstellar hook, a unique contraption designed uh, and deployed by the controversial Harvard physicist Avi Loeb. Oh, controversial! Mm -hmm. It is uh, uh, it is on the hunt for alien material, and it may have found some. Rewind four years. The cigar-shaped comet. Amua Amua. See? All right. ah, it's all coming together now. Rewind four years. And Loeb was thinking about another strange object, the cigar-shaped comet Amua Amua. Oh, my God. It's like we planned this. It's amazing. Which silently slipped past our planet on October the 17th, mm -hmm. only to disappear forever into the void of space. The void of this space. This was Earth's first known interstellar visitor, a rogue voyager that may have traveled <clears throat> for some 600,000 years to reach our little blue marble. Loeb's quest to understand it earned him a new nickname, The Alien Hunter of Harvard. Oh, what a great a name. A best-selling book, and no small degree of criticism from fellow scientists. With this comet in mind, Loeb decided to search for other cosmic anomalies. And this is what led him via a team of university students 
um, and a handy catalogue of fireballs detected around the Earth to IM-1, a weird meteorite that exploded over the Pacific Ocean at 3.05 a.m. local time, the 9th of January, 2014. Interesting, interesting. Now, Loeb thinks he's found some remnants of this interstellar, uh, of this celestial interloper. Could these rare fragments, each around a third of a millimeter long, be debris from a distant solar system? He uh, Has he really managed to sift them out from the vastness of the Pacific? And why is the search so provocative? A stark reminder, it's a startling fact that no human has ever personally encountered material from outside our solar system, <coughs> at least not knowingly. Well, I mean that, yeah. Um, despite 66 years <coughs> of space exploration and hundreds of missions collecting samples from the moon, solar wind, asteroids, low Earth orbit, as well as more than 70,000 meteorites that we have found on the surface of our planet, the space debris scattered across the world's museums is all from our own cosmic neighborhood. Even the dinosaur killing one, cool. Oh, may have come, what? Could have come from the Oort cloud. How have I never heard of the Oort cloud? You've never heard of the Oort cloud? No! The Oort cloud. That's such a funny name. Yeah, it's basically uh, the dust around the dust on the system. edge. Yeah. And it came in. Oh, fucking. It literally came in and was like, I hate that dinosaur. Yeah, the Oort cloud's famous mm -hmm. as well. Well, yeah. The planetary science community has gathered an amazing body of knowledge about these objects, but we've never been able to study material from another solar system. The planets and asteroids around um, a distant star, says Mark Fry's. Um, Cosmic Dust Curator at NASA. Wow. Nice. Dust. Um, we know these systems exist, but we've never been able to study them in a laboratory um, or a laboratory. Everything we know about space is from our, uh, from beyond our impact comes from observing the light. Uh, is that even true anymore? We're not even observing Everything light about anymore. space beyond our own patch comes from observing the light that has made it, yeah. We're observing other radiations now. Um, true, true. But Thanks. We consider all radiation light. Thanks, Webby. Yeah, true. Uh, do we? I thought we considered all light radiation. I didn't know everything Same was... Same thing. It's interchangeable. Uh, okay. Um, local cosmic sniffer dust. Exactly. Basically... That's so cool. When M1 slammed into the Earth, no one noticed. The only record of existence was the US government, whose sensors recorded its trajectory, speed, and altitude as it streaked through the atmosphere over the Atlantic Ocean near Portugal. I fell in the... I thought it fell in Portugal. the... Portugal. Okay. Um... Any further details, if they exist, can be found in classified documents. Uh, not because it's a UFO, but because making the public would reveal too much about the, capa the capabilities of the military equipment that found it. But there are enough crucial details in the database to pique Loeb's interest for a start. IM-1 was hurtling along at an uncanny speed. All stars are moving gradually orbiting the... All the stars in the Milky Way are moving gradually orbiting its center. Um, though... In the case of our sun, a single revolution can take 230 million years. Damn. As they travel, they take the contents of their solar systems with them. This means that any object that entered our solar neighborhood would already be bringing the speed set by its own star. As it got closer to the sun's gravitational pull, it would fall towards it, increasing pace yet further. As a result, scientists expect um, that interstellar meteorites would be moving faster than regular ones. Loeb's analysis suggested that not only was IM-1 moving more rapidly than our own solar system, it was also traveling faster than 95% of the stars nearby. This, uh, he believes, suggests that it was interstellar. So, he thinks it's from the outer space. And it might be, but they don't want him to look. And I don't see why you shouldn't look. I think looking's a good idea. Yeah, I think looking's Why not have a peep? Why not? If you if you got like the funding, mm -hmm. uh, go for it. Mm -hmm. Hell yeah. I support that. But um, I'll see if I can find the video that I watched this about in the first place that I thought was interesting because it was actually an interview with him. It, it, it was just tingling in the back of my brain. Yeah. And he was basically like, it's really interesting. I think it came from somewhere else. I would like to have a look at it. Um, I mean, admittedly, News Nation is saying it could be alien tech, but I'm not sure how much I trust News Nation. Mm -hmm. So, you know what I mean? But, yeah, it's fucking Tesla. Came back in. Double speed. What's the chat? Just want to say, um, just quickly. Uh, yes. Yeah, uh, me and Emily did see about Sinead O'Connor. Um, it is very sad. Yeah. I don't. I quickly Googled it. I One, I do request that we obviously don't do someone died in chat. Mm -hmm. I know it's a live stream. I know we're live and you want like live reaction to stuff. But I think that it's a bit tasteless and not good. Um, also, On our part, it seems react, like... You know. Yeah. It also seems like sad. Um, and at the same time, um, it seems like potentially 
Yeah, it's 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 a sad story. It's a sad story. It's and not, I don't yeah. really think. Yeah, somebody came in and chat and was like, "Sinead O'Connor." That's okay. Like, I understand. Mm-hmm. It's a, it's a very human thing to do that yeah. to be sort of like, "Oh my god, something happened." Mm-hmm. Let's let's let's, yeah. let's discuss it. But as you all but know, in general, we yeah. we don't do that, and mm-hmm. um, it is sad, and it's, it yeah. seems like a very sad circumstance yeah. what happened. Mm-hmm. Um, so we're just gonna say, yeah, we saw it, and yeah. um. And I don't really want to segue away from like, oh my god, an aliens rail into like, oh somebody's. Yeah, yeah. no, I don't really have anything yeah. to say about it either. Yeah, that's sad. You know what I mean? Like, it's really shit. Um. um anyway, we a should reminder. start our sponsor stream. Yeah. Two hours, and it's already nearly oh, eight o'clock. Oh, chat. So, chat. We're going to be playing mm. a game uh, called uh, as- um. Good luck. Asim altered axis, which is a mouthful, and um. Yeah, it's a, it's a demo that's currently available on Steam. Um, let me put us in the category. Yes. So we have a video game they have asked for us to play today. I am excited to try it with Fred. It's actually a game we can co-op, so we can play it together, mm-hmm. which is nice. Um, games. Games. In this channel. Um, I it's also, unheard of. You are you guys. You are free to uh, download the game and uh, all that sort of stuff. It is a demo. Uh, yeah, we're literally theme. just playing the demo. We're not even playing like the full no. game. It's not even out yet, but you can play the demo. And if you, when I played it earlier, it was literally just Fred and I. Like we yeah. were the only people playing at the time. So if you guys want to play, uh, we will be playing against you most likely or with you. Yes. So um, it so is what it is. This is the game. Mm-hmm. I'm going to bring. Uh, I'm going to switch to Emily. Emily. Scarface. Why would you turn on Calypso like that? Those are pretty solid drinks. How dare you? Oh, also, let me just do the thing. What in the blue fuck? That's just what oh, England's yeah. like, deeds. Oh, valid. Um, give the link a good old click. But yeah, you can try it. You can go. As I yeah. said, when Fred and I played it earlier, it was literally just us. So, um, also, are we going to go live on TikTok? I don't mind either way. Um, we can't go live on TikTok. We don't have to, but I was just letting you know that if we do, we're on the wrong cameras. Sound of very Manchester. I want to get myself a little drink. What do you reckon? Um, Got but yeah. Out. Oh, that's annoying. I'm moving up my screen. Chat. So this game's kind of crazy. I tried it out earlier because I wanted to check it was working. Can you even hear anything? Probably not. I might need to fix my banana. Uh, yeah, your banana is not. My working. banana. But is my whole computer muted? It was muted. Um, yeah, play it out loud. So, I was playing this earlier, and I was like, what is going on? So I'm this little dude, right? It's very odd. I don't know. It was, I was having fun with Fred, but it, it, I don't know. I've never... So he's got, like, three modes, right? So you've got, I'm a little dude mode. You guys are not prepared. Change forms. You've got, I'm giant space hands. I'm big. I'm floating. Now, the way the game works is it's kind of, yeah, I was like, they were like, you can be a uh, big hands in space or a little guy. And I was like, <laughs> what? Why would I be big hands or a little guy? But what I can tell you is, is that basically you can, so this is your world. You can like edit it however you want. Yeah. Essentially what it is, is you either play big sky hands, who is trying to capture little dude who's running around. Or you play little dude who's running around and you're trying to collect stuff from around their base and then get out. So the idea is basically you have to get in, steal a bunch of stuff and get out and big hands in the sky. Essentially, you, you got to find the, the, the intruder, the mm-hmm. invader, I think they're called. Yeah, you uh, guys can intruder. really slap Fred. If yeah. you do want to download this, if we get enough people who can, like, because Fred and I can play against each other and it's mm-hmm. fine. But if you guys do decide you want to download this, I'm happy to let you guys play God at least some of the rounds so that you can just slap us about because you can you hate your hands that's tragic um but yeah let's see if we can get into a match em. so i guess i'll start as hands and you can start as a uh... yeah that's how we played earlier okay so i'm going okay so we should queue at the same time yeah I just started where's my mouse now. okay i'm gonna go infiltrate okay yeah it's happening yes it's happening mm-hmm. i'll just boot up any excuse to slap fred yeah because <laughs> right if you guys do just let us know 
purely because we'll need to make sure that we all queue at the same time. Yeah. And obviously, Fred and I will need to be in a little group together. Of course, chat, this is a sponsored stream. Wow. So thank you very much to uh, the developers for sponsoring the mm -hmm. stream. I uh, appreciate it a lot. Uh, Asim Altered Axis is a uh, is a fun little uh, party game. Um, might, I don't know, maybe it will get competitive. So I think you can have up to five people in your group. Because the game's quite dark, I'm going to turn Gamma up. Yeah, it's really dark. I don't know why it's daytime when you're on the thing, but now it's nighttime. So I've got a little mm -hmm. spotlight. I'm, I'm the big hands floating in the sky. Yeah, if I hold still for a second, Emily might be able to... Um... Hang on, I'll look for the big hands. I'm not going like, to look for you. I'm just going like, to float um, around. Where, okay, so that is the... So I guess i got to go through here. See, it's, I'm following the thing at the top of the screen. Mm -hmm. Ah, okay, so here is Fred's world. Ah! Oh, you spotted me, I take it. Do you understand how creepy that is? <laughs> okay, so other things that you need to know. Oh um, my god. When we, when, we, when we messed around earlier, yeah. I used up a bunch of my special powers and mm. they're still gone. What does that mean? I don't, how do I get my special Are powers back? Are you never going to get them back? I don't know. God's lost his power? My god. Hey, Bitburner, how you doing? I'm glad you think so. Right, so you see this is a crazy ball. Yo, what so up, my bit job is to... <laughs> Ow! What the f Okay, well that gave me a-, a no, Oh, I spotted no, you! No, 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 I just wanted to show you I can shoot God's hands! Okay, also this guy. Alright, I got you level one M, which means you're more visible now. Oh, don't. Don't. We need to- Fred, um, it's a sponsored stream, we need to show people sponsored gameplay. Stream. Oh my god. So, I have to run around, collect these doodads up. Oh my god, no! No! He slap! Get out of here! Okay, so I gotta run around and collect up some stuff. Where's my, where's my gun? Whoa! <laughs> Stop! Right. Okay, I shouldn't have shot you. I think I gave my position away too quickly. Now I've lost you. So again. I gotta collect up something. Now, I'm pretty oh, sure you, also, when chat. you sprint, you glow, which makes you stand out way more. You're not ready for this. Oh, okay, that's good. Wait, I thought it was F. Oh my god! No, it's Oh, there you me. are! I didn't, I didn't no! mean that. Uh -huh. Get away! I was walking slowly through the gems. Um, what's what's happening? There's like an exclamation mark behind me. Can you not? That's so disrespectful. Okay. Wait. I'm sure I can become a no! Gotcha! Wait! Ah! No! I can become a cat, but I've been <laughs> None of you were expecting this! Oh, you're not in there anymore. Oh, you moved. <gasps> but how you doing, Bitburner? No! It's good to see you, man. <laughs> what? Oh, I don't even I know what you did. I'm in a trap. Ah, it's a big spring. my traps. Where are you even? It's a big spring. No, it's over. I'm a cat forever now. Let me be free. Oh my god, no! I died. Oh. Now. I'm a cube. I'm back. Okay. I, I, I have more than one life, but I'm not clear on why, but we're not discussing it. Now, please don't kill me again. Thank you. You don't even know where I spawned, do you? No. Yes. Also, chat, this is really funny. See so these big scary robots? I can two-tap them with a punch. <laughs> it's so weird. Knew. You can't even imagine my face when I loaded this up earlier, and I was like, well, I started off with the whole bit where they're like, you can edit. Can you not be hurting me right now? What the hell have I walked into? I can't even hear that, man. Okay, thank God. I'm just trying to collect me some cubes. Mama needs a cube. Now, I will say... Mama needs a cube. Mama needs a cube. I'm not sure why I need a cube. I don't know why well, you've these... you got to infiltrate. You're an infiltrator. I'm, I'm just going to get you. me cube. Get out your cube. Yeah, well, I don't need info. Ah, oh, he's dead. There we go. See, that's how you do it. But, yeah, there are traps around the map. There's that big ball one. There's the one that, like... Dude, did you edit your friggin' map? A little bit. Don't look! You looked, you cheat! I was wondering what you were looking you're at. You're a liar! You're a cheater! Because my robots mm. give off uh, a yellow light as well, so it's very mm. confusing. Oh. It's difficult being the hands of God. Uh, so, I'm just gonna run around, do a great gerb. <laughs> you saw me. Oh. I've been spotted. Oh, Wait, my turret got me? you. My turret oh got my you. Oh my god, what the frick? Who put a turret there? Me. I moved you should everything not around. have been allowed to move your stuff. All right, I'm uh, leaving. I don't see you around the turret anymore. On a jet plane. 
Don't mind me, I'm getting shot. Fred, you can't put all the turrets on top of the thing. You're getting me murdered. Oh god, it's over. It's over. Jar the cat, the hands, the hands of horror. No, I got slapped. 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 You stop slapping? Dude, this is so unkind. I'm stealing. <laughs> stop the steal. Did you just quote Homestar Runner? Yeah. Oh, uh, what did you say? I don't know. It's just undoubtable that I did. Oh, hello. Don't look! Ah, oh, you suck. Look out for that. I'm over you. I'm leaving. I'm sneaking off. Get a gerb! Good job, yes! Moran. I literally can't not say gerb <laughs> now. Gerb. How do I get back all of Friends my... screen watching! Boo. I wasn't... Emily just went, ah! And I was like, what? All right. I completely lost. I don't know how... To... Okay, my only concern is I don't know how to get... My, cause I had a bit, I could put robots down. I could do all kinds of stuff. Can I pick it back yeah, up? Yeah, I don't know how to get your powers back, but I love that for me. Mm, I don't know where you are. I want to blow you up. Yeah, I say get a gerb all the time. Or I got a gerb. Bring in the from Apple screen so Fred can't screen watch. He is cheating. Oh. Bitch, Nexus, Nexus taken. <laughs> oh god! Oh, oh god! What have you done? Get to the portal! Oh my god! Okay, I'm getting to the portal. I'm getting to the portal. I'm getting to the portal. To the portal! Thanks. You actually kind of slapped me in the right direction. Holy Bounced. moly! <laughs> Bounce! <laughs> Things are not looking good for me. No, 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 no. Where are these hands? Frick you, hands! Come back. Oh! Not that close. I'm on fire! Oh, I think God, it's I'm over gonna run for out me. Of hands. You're gonna run out of hands? That's so cringe. Oh, you're on fire though. Mm -hmm. Three, two, I'm alive. I'm alive, baby. Where are they? Where? Oh! Get ya! Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> three! Three HP! I really should have gone for stealth. Okay, so don't step on that. That's gonna kill me. You ever been shot? You ever shot, God? You got your first 1k. <laughs> Ow! Where? Oh, I see you. <laughs> nice! Good job, Tommy. Thank you for watching the stream. I'm glad you've been enjoying it. Um, no! No! No slapper! Boom! Son of a bitch. Slapped! Well, wake up! Am I alive? Sir, 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 slapper, duh. Okay, so, to my knowledge, which is, I admit, limited, oh, my, I... My trap's no. got popping off. No, 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 no. I just said your name on screen for a second. Yeah, it does sometimes. I um am freaking out. I have three lives. I've died twice. So I think this is a do or die situation for me. Which I'm not thrilled about. There you are. Okay, the big ball! I've always wanted to see one of these in action. Not too close though. Come on, big ball, do something. Oh shit, I shouldn't have announced that. Don't look, I'm not <laughs> anywhere. If you've thought of a big ball, don't think about it. No! No, I should not have said that. Oh, I've haggarded myself. Time to solve my problems the only way I know how. By becoming a cat. Goodbye, idiots. <laughs> <laughs> you wouldn't explode a cat. I'm opening the anus. <laughs> no! <laughs> I don't know. Am I leaving? Am I winning? I think I'm winning. I'm just going to be... Are you? There's no way. I don't know. It's unclear. Situation unclear. Leaping! Nope. <laughs> Mate, I'm running out of slaps. Running out of slaps? Stop! No! you got to find out a way to do your stuff. Right, did I do it? Am I done? Is it I think over? you've got to jump through. I think you've got to escape through the portal. Okay. Steal. Escape, still I one. I only out. stole one out of two? What did I get? Get! Yeah. I got 40. You got 900. Why did you get 40 cubes? I, I don't idea. think I picked up 900 cubes. Doesn't feel like I picked up 900 cubes. Okay. So that is the basic principle of the experience. Yeah, pretty much. Um. Ooh, Rendezvous with Rama. It's a really good sci fi book about humans encountering an interstellar object. In 2130. Well, they should. So, I've also got the world edit chap. Oh, yeah. 
in which I can like move stuff around and uh, basically edit everything. So yeah, Fred already edited his to make it harder. I did a little bit, yeah. Scoundrel. Well, I think I need to edit edit even further. So I need to grab this. Are you gonna you gonna uh, stay as God? Reposition things. Well, I don't know. I, I guess I could I could play as the. Uh... I mean, I haven't played as God yet. And I don't know if I want to, but I can. Oops. And also, I still should theoretically have all of my stuff. True, true, Because I'm not actually. sure why all your stuff ran out. Because, like, last round, Fred had a lot more weapons than just slapping. Yeah, I had loads of stuff. I'm not sure why I don't have it anymore. I'm kind of, I'm kind of annoyed. Yeah, it's valid. Oh, look, I've got a fence. I can stop you from... Boom. Put another fence in. Boom. Don't mind me, chat. Building fences. Defenses. <laughs> Fences are probably the most annoying thing you could put in this game because it's dark when you play. So you just run into stuff and you're like, what is this? Who put this here? Oh, wait, I know who put this here. This son of a bitch. Watch your language. What is with this language? When did a fence ever stop a cat? Good point and good question. And, and frankly, valid. But yeah, I cannot deny that when I first loaded up this game and they're like, yeah, you can just run around in the world, I was like, I need more instruction. What am I doing? I need more guidance, please. Bro, working at Amazon has made me question people's laziness. Oh no, what's the dumbest thing you've had delivered? Oh no. Like what, what, what's making you say that? That's uh, Tyler on TikTok. What's, yeah, Tyler, what's going on, dude? Fred, mid-battle. Let me just edit this map. Look, I'm just going to run around for a bit. And Fred's just... Look, you can work out what these things do. Dude, if you could get fewer fucking gun turrets, that would be great. Rather than I evenly like spreading turrets. them out like a little leech. The turrets bully the hell out of me. Got more traps. I need to... Over my own stream on TikTok so I can see chat. Oh my god, it's me! Wow, nobody saw this coming. Dude, um, mm -hmm. There's been three mm. bottles of water and someone ordered the <laughs> smallest bag of dog food known to man. <laughs> Maybe they got a really small dog. I'm not gonna lie, I know it would be boring like immediately. But getting the opportunity to see what people are actually ordering when they're like ordering stuff online. Like, most of it would be boring, but I'm sure you get some deliveries where you're like, What? So, should we try it the other way around, Em? Do you want me to, do you want to go as hands? And I'll go as uh, infiltrate? Okay. Okay. I'm the hands! I'm not in that game. Oh my god, I'm slapping a stranger! You are slapping a okay, stranger. Fred, I need your advice. If you're not in I'm the game. Yeah. Doesn't seem like I am, mm -hmm. Em. People, 20 kilograms of white vinegar. What? What in the world? What? what game is this? This is a game called Asim Altered Axis. Yes, it is a, we're doing a sponsor stream today. Yeah. And um, yeah, we're basically uh, showing it off. You can download it for free if oh you God, want. You're, you're playing against someone else. This is insane. Oh my God, Fred, what do I do? All right, you okay, so find I'm looking for the dude. So they usually spawn, see on your mini map where the portal's up north? They usually spawn in the in the woods, mm -hmm. and so they're they're not super hard to spot because if someone there he is, you already spotted him. Nice, there he so is. So you need to you need mm -hmm. to yeah. Once you highlight them mm -hmm. and the circle goes around, the more the higher the alert you get them on, the um yeah yeah yeah, the more visible they become. Or is that a robot? Uh, I don't. That doesn't. I don't think there's any robots there. I think you there he is. And so you got a mouse wheel to get your different abilities. The first one slap. That's a big nuclear blasting that recharges. Yeah, yeah, keep him highlighted. Keep him highlighted. Dude, what? When you get a, when you get a full circle, mm -hmm. they, get, they go up. So you already got him on one. There he is. Oh, he got he you bounced, out. He bounced. He bounced. Gonna bounce down in the same spot. Mm -hmm. The same spot. Where is he? He did get yoked. He bounced. He bounced. Is he dead? He he took to space. My robots did nothing. No. There you go. So that's so a fireball. Fireball. You got six of those. Uh, I've lost my man. We gotta find him. This is why it's dark. Now I understand. Oh my god, I've lost my dude. I've lost him. Oh 
shit. Damn it! What kind of level one is this? Hmm. Where's my man? And he's gonna be heading to. Is that you? No. What's he heading towards? I don't even know what this stuff looks like from your angle. Um. So he's also collecting squares. He's collecting squares. Well, I'm not seeing any squares missing. You better start getting some squares, Sonny Jim. Where is he at? So you see those two blue things there? Those yeah. are the stealing things. I put them right next to mm -hmm. each other because it makes it easier. But when they're steel, it's pretty... It's, they got a big... It's a big mm -hmm. laser beam. It's pretty obvious. Chat, we've got a game giveaway happening. Who's won? Oh, chat. Vextra Penguin has won a free game. Congratulations. It doesn't help that these squares do be popping in and out. Somehow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, you won uh, Remnant from the Ashes. Oh, that's the game. That's the the sequel, the, the previous game. So nice! Remnant two. Nice. You got the first Remnant. Nice. Dude, I'm not even seeing anyone shooting anything. No, it's weird. I haven't seen him since he got yo in the air. You got I'm worried yo for him. Are you yo okay? <laughs> You're okay, bro. Hey, dude. It's me, the big hands. Like, are we? Are we still having a good time here? Have you been injured? <laughs> so yeah, you've got 99 slaps. You've got six explosions, another six explosions. Mm -hmm. 10 um, robot dudes you can put down. So yeah, I don't know where he is then. I don't know either. It's annoying because I found him so quickly. You did. So you level one alert. Mm -hmm. Nearly had level two. It's not even that big. No. Come out, you little bitch. And he's not set anything off. It's weird, right? He got he got it's yoted. Just dead quiet. He was running around, he got yoted in the air. Did he get yoted out of the game? Oh my god, imagine. If he's just gone and I'm just running around. Well that's what's making me suspicious. Like what if the physics was too crazy and his whole computer crashed? Where's my man? And like, he gives off a golden glow when he runs. Yeah. But it's okay for him not to be sprinting. But like, my dude would have so many gems right now. And he shouldn't be that traumatized. All I did was look at him. Mm -hmm. I never even slapped. Hey, Grey Marks, how you doing? Hey! Chat, this is a sponsor stream. Thank you very much for everyone for tuning in and uh, checking out the sponsor, sponsor stream. If you guys are enjoying it, um, just give me a smiley face in the chat. So this is like the spawn area. Mm -hmm. Where is he? I don't know. I'm wondering if maybe he doesn't know what the hell he's doing. Maybe. Which is valid because it did... Well, I mean, I did work it out in my first game, but, you know, I am an extremely good you gamer. You are a high-level gamer. I was like, Fred, I'm a gamer, just so you know. Dude, he's gone. I do not believe he's still Vanished. on this map. So I just start slapping. Just like, where are the gems disappearing? It still looks like they're evenly everywhere. And like, no gamer, no matter how stupid, can resist a gem. Yeah, the thing is, there are quite a lot... I agree with you about staying still and looking. The trouble is, is that most of the screen is dark. Yeah. So, you really only... And if they're not running, they don't have yellow coming off them. Yeah, they if they, if they so, like, crouch or, mm -hmm. like, walk, they're not going to glow. But, he was running before. I wish there was an indicator to how many, um... How many, um, yeah, my gems things? missing. Yeah, I don't see any missing gems, but I don't know how quickly they come back after they get nabbed up. You know what I mean? Oh, maybe they do come back. I never even considered that. But like, this is so weird. You never had to look for me this long. No. I am really worried he got yo out of the game. Oh. <laughs> don't panic, sir. I will help you. Yay! I helped. <laughs> He's free. You're free now. Go about your business. Where it is the I. hell is this guy? The spectral eye. 
Here to tell you the news and weather. News and weather. I'm going to start slapping at random. Mm, but I don't want to use up my slaps. Slap. Incorrect. I've got to increase attention. Like, i gotta, I got to give this man some fear, wherever he may be. Eliminate infiltrators. Interacting? Yeah, it's the ball. The ball? It's the ball right in front of you. So press F. Oh! You damaged something. Why did I hurt? Who's injured? Get your flash the flashlight. It might have been him. Hello! Do you feel like you've been recently run over by a ball? Peachy, give thing us something. Grey mm -hmm. marks. Grey marks. Woo! Welcome to the Mug Life. Mm. Welcome to the way of the Dragon, Dragon Flex. Flex. Chat, can we please get some love in the chat for not only for Peachy for gifting us up, but also mm. for Grey Marks for coming back. Thank you very much. Uh, 20 mm. months, Grey Marks. Nice. Watching you offense. on both Twi uh, Twitch and TikTok. Nice. Oh, hell yeah, Vation Zero. Thank you. Good to see you over on TikTok, dude. How you doing? Hello. Um, if you feel like you were just injured by a very large ball, you may be... <laughs> Entitled, entitled to a smooch. Entitled to compensation. Here compensation. at Giant Floating Hand Insurance, we guarantee you the most median of outcomes. What? Who's that? Nothing. Dude, he's gone. Yeah, Dude, I'm I think... I am a bit sus. He went boing boing. I think he went boing and got kicked out of the game. I think that's what happened. I mean, it's never happened to me, but I'm going to say the number of times that I have played a game where extreme physics causes someone to... Crash. To crash. It might be. Well, I'm supposed to be doing a kind of uh, spectral hide-and-seek with a scary guy, but here's the thing. Th they vanished. I know we're hiding and seeking, but I feel like we're hiding and seeking too hard at this juncture. It's too much hype. Chats want smooches. Well, have you been injured by a giant hand, chat? Or he might just be playing the most long term stealthy game of mm. all time. I mean, it's certainly p possible. What was this? Interacting? Oh. I could interact with something? Hello? Another, I think there's another ball in front of you, I think. Is there more ball? It's, it's a bit dark to see, but it's yeah. It's really dark. I can't even see this ball. I love the ball. I want to continue. I, oh, there it is. Hey, ball. Let's go on another journey. Oh, I killed one of my children. Uh, uh, so you get for being so weak. Toughen up. I don't know. Is, if you press tab, is there a leaderboard? No. 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 Cell zero? Is that me? I don't know. Did you collect cells? I think cells are... Do we assume... I have genuinely That it's no not idea. gone well and restart. <laughs> also, I'm interested because if you notice at the top, it says eliminate infiltrators. And it's got like a pink thing. Yeah. Have they been eliminated? Like, did they eliminate themselves by leaving? Because it's like, don't let them escape. That's not got a logo on it. Find infiltrators. That's not got a logo on it. Raise the alert level. I'm restarting. Okay. Can I though? Uh, Escape? Escape does nothing. Oh, you literally... I'm stuck as the giant oh, hand. No. Uh, I'm cursed to be a god for all time. Whoa, that is a hell of a b -b bomb. Hmm. Let's see what this looks like. Oh, I'm killing all my children. No. Are you okay, Sonny? <laughs> Yeah, I think this man's gone. Now, I may have to restart okay. the entire actual game because otherwise I don't know how to leave. Cool, I'll just leave it put it on my screen. Mm -hmm. That's annoying. I was so close to defeating a stranger. That's what I wanted. Oh, was he just doing this the entire time? Like hiding in. Hiding well, I mean, in then the he ruined his bush. game. He made it boring and then yeah. they left. So you lost via boredom. Oh my god, look at you guys remembering stuff. I've never even heard of it. 
Frank, can I have your friend code? I'm pretty sure there are EU and US servers, and literally no one. No, there's no one playing on our side either, dudes. I'm not even joking. How do I do friend code? Yeah, you've been on the funny game screen for 20 minutes? Yes, I did that earlier. There is a chance that if, if you press infiltrate and I press hands, or vice versa, we might we might get queued up together. That might be fun. But also Fred and I could press it again and then we could try, because Fred just sat there and watched me play the hands. Yeah. Do you want to try it again? Right. Sure, let's try it one more time. Okay. okay. In three, two, two one. one. Emily is the big hand again, and I got left out. Oh, no. Oh, no. No, Deeds. Is this actually you? Oh, Deeds. Deeds. Am I the big hand? Am I about to slap at your cheeks? I'm ready. All right, all right. I'm ready. Deeds about to get her cheeks mm. clapped by Emily. It was oh, only it was only a matter of time. Oh, fuck, you found Fred on Steam? Oh, okay. Okay, we'll try this again. Uh, okay, so we need to head over here to where the fucking little shits start. All right, little shits. Hello. So they'll have spawned oh, somewhere over no here. What? I only have a torch. You only have a big butter boom. You got no other thing else. Well, how am I gonna win? I don't know. I can't. I can't even slap. You cannot even slap. I think. I don't know. I have no idea. I don't know what that the deal with that is. Man. I can't even slap. All right. I'm going to sit here and wait for gems to start disappearing. And then what am I going to do? Look at them really angrily? I guess you just have to use your nuclear blast on them if you find them. Yeah, but they, i got to kill them three times. I think this is the same game you were in because it's... um. Right. It's level one detection. Do you see? I, th I was going to say that. Right, I think you're right. In the cyber case, life, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. Hey! In which case, are we screwed? I don't know. Well, I'm in matchmaking. Mm -hmm. Matchmaker, matchmaker, so... make me a match. So if I leave this game... Okay, so if I leave this game... Leave the game. Mm -hmm. And then I restart the game. By the way, chat, this game is available on Steam as a demo. If anyone wants to uh, mm -hmm. download it and come play, you're more than welcome. Add it to your wish list, all that stuff. Yeah, I have no idea why that's the case, Tommy. I mean, I didn't even use my big hand abilities. And even then, I just didn't have them. Like, I got 100 slaps. Yeah, I am confused as to how you recharge them as well. Oh, I figured that out. You have to go escape to here mm -hmm. to project customize. Oh, protect customize. And you add them to your list. And you do the same thing with the other with the uh, infiltrate. You can add more smoke bombs, all that sort of stuff. Add more, or add more gun. More gun. Yeah, okay, I'm just ice wall. Oh, it's crazy. Okay, I just added a bunch of stuff to mine. Nice. Oh, there's also gun? A uh, gun oh. for uh dude, little guy. For infiltrator. Okay. I was hoping the hand could just be like blah 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 You know? Uh oh. Fred's in a game! I'm in a game against the against someone's yes! hand. Yes! Against somebody else's hand. Let's All right. go! All right. Let's see if we can do this, chat. Mm-hmm. Don't get defeated. You probably will be. It's quite difficult. The fact that I beat you the first round is actually very random. Also, don't forget, you can become a cat. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. It's helpful. Because you've never the played. The should be infinite, right? I agree. So, one, shooting is kind of pointless because you can punch everything. Two, uh, well, it's not pointless. Like, yeah. it has its uses, but, like, it's more stealthy to punch. Okay, there's big hands. Big hands. Is it just me or do I have any friends? Well, if there are other people playing big hands, we could actually team up and play together. Because I think the reason that when I play the game solo, it feels unbalanced is... No! Oh! 
<laughs> Big hands, why? <laughs> let's let's try to get. Maybe we can get another okay, five versus cool. enemy game. Do you want to be infiltrate yeah, or protect? Yeah, be infiltrate. Okay, I'm protect. All right, three, two, one. Bam. Oh, oh there it goes. Okay. Fred versus Emily. Yeah, you baby. snuck in, Deeds. Mm -hmm. Is it gonna be? Is it me and me and Deeds versus Emily? Oh. That would be so pog. Wait, what happened, Deeds? Because maybe we can um maybe we can add you to like the party or something, or maybe Fred and I could team up. I don't know. I just want to know that you're like getting connected. Mm -hmm. Me and Fred versus M. Do you think? Ho, 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 ho. That would be very oh, exciting, oh, oh, oh. If, if true. Oh, yeah, Deeds, I see, <gasps> I see you. I see a little dude. No. Two versus one. Two versus one. Frick. No. I have to let my cat charge up, I think. Yeah, you do. Not that I should be helping you because you're an enemy. I glanced. What's that? Oh my god! Oh my god! I saw you get a cube! Ah! <laughs> no! <laughs> no! I'm being mm. spotted! How do I stop being spotted? Mm. Deeds, help! Oh. Who shoot? Deeds isn't helping you. Get spotted. Get spotted to the nth degree! Shoot a god! It's me! Ow! Uh, Woo! I'm winning! A lot of level three! Everyone's getting injured probably. By me, the hands. Yeah, but these are still out there. What, you dead? No. Oh my god, is she doing stuff? Deech, you better not be doing anything. Don't make me look away from Fred. I'm twirling. Woo! Why? <laughs> I see you, little chicken nugget. Fred wants me to remember Deets. I'll never remember Deets. Where the hell's my boy? Oh my god, it's so bright! This yeah. is how this works. Wow, I you've think really the more, screwed up Deets' first level. The more alert there mm -hmm. is. Where's Deets? I got a fireball for someone. Stop being in the trees. Oh my god, she's bloody, she's stealing it! She's stealing it! No, my bloody Nexus! Slap! Come on, you idiot robots, do something! Get her! Don't you shoot me, you son of a bitch. Oh god, where's she gone? Deeds. It's raining hands. Woo, hallelujah, it's raining hands. Don't shoot, God. Where the fuck? Get out of here. Fireball. Take you it down. Idiot. My gamer moves. <laughs> Fireball. Dude. Boof. Oh my god, that did nothing. All right, I'm out of bullets. Mm -hmm. Whoa, what hit me? You're out of bullets? Yeah. <laughs> Get slap. I'm doing it. God never loses. All right. That's what they said to... God never <laughs> loses. <laughs> this is stupid. Yeah, I was being so Oh my oh, god, no. Deeds is getting... Mm -hmm. Wow, you can't ex escape. You're not even helping Deeds. What are you even doing? I swear. <laughs> Come on, Deeds has got to die at least once before she escapes. This woman is so zippy. Giant Italian mm -hmm. hands. <laughs> My robot ain't doing shit either. Dude, I can't believe she snuck all that time. 
Let's pay too much attention to Fred. Deeds, I've got the portal open. <laughs> <laughs> no, Deeds! No! You gotta get to the pool, Deeds! No! Deeds can't do shit! Get her, robot! Uh, get her good. <laughs> get to the pool, Deeds! No! Come on. Whoa! Oh, I killed her! But she's gonna come back like yeah. any second. Did you just escape? I escaped, yeah. You left to Deeds. Yeah, fuck it. Yeah. I, I can do Wait, it. Ah, she's back! Our portal's still open too. Deeds, you can shoot the hands. Mm -hmm. Emily's not got much life left. <laughs> oh my god. Can I heal? Yep. I think so. No! Do not shoot the hands! Oh, Deeds get messed second up. Second death, second death! This is such <laughs> bullying. I, I actually feel really bad. Uh, I don't think I'm handling being God terribly well. Detected. Detected. I just want to remind you how detected you are. You are extremely detected. Get her, robot! Oh, she's dodging. She's, she's duking. Nobody tell, <laughs> nobody tell Ron DeSantis there's a game where you can be God and smack lesbians. <laughs> It'll be all over it. I don't feel good. I might let her leave. Oh, don't shoot me! All right, that's it. I was going to let you dead, get out. She's almost dead. I was going to let you leave. You almost killed God. <laughs> I am actually very nearly dead, which I don't love. Death is not good for me. Yeah, also, I don't know if anyone saw Deeds that she can literally two... She can literally two tap my friggin' My robots that I dropped. No! Get out of here! Get out! I can't believe you left Deeds. No. <laughs> I can't believe it. Fred, come on. I couldn't do anything. You could have shot me. No, I ran out of bullets. Told you. Oh, good. No, but I can't slap her to death. Oh, no! She killed you. Am I dead? Yeah. What? Oh, you, you revived and you got out. Deeds! She did it! Do I need to buy tier mm -hmm. one to get the option for tier two? Seven? No, no. No, you just click on the, mm -hmm. the, the subscribe button. There's a bunch of options. <laughs> <laughs> that, that was, was stupid. Great. That was so silly. Oh, that was funny. Wow. Well, I got two kills, which is something. Now, do you? Mm, I could be the big hand. Want to be the big hand again? Mm-hmm. Ah, uh, on the mobile app, you only show tier one, right? Oh. I just got Power Wash Simulator on my Switch. Nice mooses. But yeah, it's always better not to um it's always better not to sub on mobile like in the app yeah it's better to sub on desktop even if you open it on your phone exactly swell yeah so basically mm -hmm. what you want to do you want to go open your browser yeah and go to twitch.tv slash family slash subscribe and that's the uh, the best way of doing it because that, that way it's cheaper for you we get more money uh, right, so Emily, yeah. you you want to add Deet so that you two can be in a party together, I think. Yeah, how do I do this? And um, so if you press shift tab. We're not friends with Deet. We're not friends with Deet. Hmm. I mean, unless you and I team up and then Deet cues as the big hand and gives us the slap. I mean, yeah. Deet, do you have a preference? Would you like to be the big hand? Or should I add you on Steam? Or should we just see what the gods have given us? You don't mind? Okay. Fred, Yo. I've invited you. Okay. So, if we play together and we time it with Deets, she could be the big hand. Okay. Hello, Emily. And now she can slap us around. You better not abandon me like you did Deets. Oh, I'm going to abandon the hell out of you. So, let's time yeah. it. Yeah. Oh, you're the one who's got matchmake. Okay. So, we're going to go infiltrate. I think if I join y'all, I can choose protector. Can you? 
Oh. Fred, can you choose protector hypothetically? No, only the host can start matchmaking. Because it's him. Whoa! Gesundheit, Emily. I'm allergic to God. Um, yes. There's only eight playing globally. I yeah. know there was no one earlier. I mean, we're we're surging at eight. Okay, I'm gonna press infiltrate. Cool. In like five seconds, deep. So if you press it now, by the time you've heard this, I'm gonna press it. Does that make sense? Two, three, four, five. Bing. I'm matchmaking, baby. Yeah, chat, what do you reckon? Are, are there aliens in the world? Are aliens real? Holy yeah. t heck. American politics alert. Where does Mitch, ancient Turtle McConnell, rank oh, on your I radar? Know. I know. Is he dead? I, I know of him, Devi. Yeah. Because he had a total freeze at a podium. What happened? What do you mean, like a total freeze? What, like he, fr he like froze up? Mm -hmm. Let me see. Oh my God. They outed him as an alien. He had a stroke. Hang on. We're going, ec we're going on x.com. Something went wrong? Here we go. McConnell just stopped abruptly during his opening statement during a GOP leadership presser and appeared to be unable to restart talking. Then he stepped away. Oh my god, if I'm if I get to enjoy aliens and Mitch McConnell dying in the same month, it's gonna be so good. Dude, the man's frozen up. Oof. Oh my god, he, What the fuck? That's He's ha think... he's having a there's a sign going down there. Yeah, I think that's a I Obviously, I have no idea. He could have just shat himself for all I know. Like, anything oh, could have I happened. trusted a fart. Yeah, that's like, happened. But I hey, think reboot. that could be a TIA, which is a mini stroke, which is something that happens to people when they are getting Ooh. dementia. Little mini strokes, will they give you a dementia. Ooh. Hey, Reboot, I know that because my great-grandma had dementia. Well, and she I'm had say, lots Mitch of McConnell these. deserves no less. Dude, he's confused as fuck. He's like... I mean, anyone would feel terrible. That's crazy. If you man. are trying to do stuff and then all of a sudden your body will not comply. But also, screw that guy. Ooh, thank you for the follow. I have no, I have no sympathy for that guy. No. Um, they like, just walk him out. He completely Dude. froze and unable mm. to move. Yeah, that that's a. Uh, I'm not gonna lie as well. I think Emily might be right though. The way that. They walked him out. Wasn't like, are you okay? Are you okay? They just quietly walk him out. They know there's something going on with him. A hundred percent. Because if somebody was who usually goes and gives speeches, got up to give a speech and went, you'd be like, are you okay? Are you all right? Like, do we need to reboot you? What's, what's going happened? On? Like, you know, if they, you'd be like, are you having a panic attack? Like, it's not the first time that's happened. Yeah, now, the thing is, it's, it's something that majorly bad, in my opinion, in American politics is the fact that um, you've literally got all these incredibly old people who otherwise may be up for debate whether or not they can drive a car making yeah, decisions seriously. for the country. And I don't I don't like to be ageist. I definitely think that old people still have a lot that they can contribute of in the world and they shouldn't But be. you have to be realistic. But you do have to be realistic, especially in positions like politics where people will go, well, I love the power and I don't want to give it up despite yeah. the fact that I'm not good at the job but anymore. Also, I don't want to give it up the power because I don't want my way of life which yeah. is like outdated and outmoded mm -hmm five times over by now. Mm -hmm. I want to give it up to a young person. Well, put me in a game with no powers. <laughs> oh, shit. Dude, if you back out of that game, then you need to click, can you see my little screen up here, this button here? And then you go to customize protect, and then you can add whatever stuff you want down here. So you just do that, and then you confirm it. Imagine if Biden had done this. Dude, mm -hmm. imagine. Uh... Mm -hmm. You do that, and then that saves your... Like the stuff you have? Oh! It's happening! Yeah, because people don't often know what seizures look like. It's very interesting. I didn't know. I know it's not you, but we will play with you next time. As soon as I'm able to do a tier three sub because you already deserve it, Tommy. Thank you. If Thank that's you so you, much, Tommy. If that's something you think you can, you can, you want to do, that's awesome, bro. That will push our sub count up nearly 700. It will. It will. Nah. Deet, because it wasn't you. It wasn't meant to be Deet. It wasn't got, meant to it be. Has to be it has Deet. to be Deet. Right, I'm going to rejoin your game. We're group together. Yeah, sure. That's what I'm saying. Seizures are not all about flopping about. Seizures are, like, very much can be just... Like, I, I um, my, my 
like friend's mum had epilepsy and her epilepsy would often just be her going like completely silent. Dates just gifted a tier three sub to Tommy. Oh my god, dates. <gasps> well there you go, you got your first Tommy, one for free. You just got gifted a tier three. Yo, that is awesome, chat. Over what? on Twitch, if you oh would nine. like to win a free game, type exclamation mark enter and make sure you are following. It is open Reboot. to everybody. Reboot coming in with a Woo! four months. Woo! Where are you seeing that? It's right here. Oh, Pull it up. was underneath. They just happened at the same exact time. Reboot, thank you so much for the four months Reboot. and the extra sub point. Thank you. You're amazing. Guys, we are on mm -hmm. 685 subs. Yeah. If you guys want to, um, we uh, I've we've said at 700 subs we are doing. Um, not only will I be playing. Uh, Dead by Daylight as Nick Cage because I do not like Dead by Daylight. I do not like, like being chased. It's scary. Um, but also, you get an anger crab. Yeah. Or. Thanks, Reboot. I appreciate if it. If you would rather, Fred and I purchased some extremely double spicy ramen. And we were going to do some sort of a see who can slurp the, t the ramen and not burn their face off. Yeah. It may be a bit of a bogue fest. Um, I mean, what? So, or until who taps out first. So, you guys can actually choose if you want the spicy challenge or if you want the Nick Cage challenge. Two hour NPC for a TikTok stream. <laughs> would you do it? I would do an hour. Fred would do an hour. I don't Fred's do like, I can do anything for an hour. I can do anything for an hour. I think doing two hours would make mm. me want to uh, jump off the balcony. Mm -hmm. You know what, we'd have to treat it a bit like we do at the gym, where we're like, three more reps, three more reps. I'd be like, 20 minutes down, Fred. Only 40 minutes to go. You're one third of the way through. <laughs> there are more characters? Oh, sure. I didn't know there are more characters. Hold your horses. Hold your... Oh, here's my cat. Lovely. Oh! I feel like that's going to make me look more obvious. Oh. But the dark suit, what are your thoughts? Do you think the dark suit adds oh, to oh. stealth? Okay, so Fred is the large cat. I went for the large cat. Nice. Misa Coco, you won the game giveaway. Hey, started by Deeds nice. and Tommy's tier three sub. And you're a Turok. Time to be Ooh, Turok. a dinosaur. Been uh, trying to play Tarkov recently mm -hmm. and died straight away each time. It that's kind of how Tarkov beats mm -hmm. sometimes. Don't forget, Tarkov is also full of uh, full of cheaters, by the way. Yes, I want you to know two things. One, it is full of cheaters. Two, it is very difficult. And also, um, you sometimes even like the best players that happens to playing Tarkov like involves you being okay with the fact that sometimes you just get ganked and it's not your fault. Can I ask what this game's about? You can. It would make more sense if we were actually in the game. We're basically in the lobby right now, which is why nothing's happening. So this game is basically where mm -hmm. you and up to five other players can infiltrate uh, the map. And there is a great big pair of hands in the sky. And uh, their job is to protect. So we have to get in. And there's like a bunch of like cubes. Uh, they kind of look like these cubes, but they're more like uh, transparent. And you can collect cubes. And the, the cubes are actually what you use to spend so you can sort of see over here um you can spend your cubes on on this stuff so basically more and as a wait if i go here infiltrator yeah so i can get um get some smoke grenades yeah let's get some smoke grenades hell yeah and then that way i can basically like throw a smoke down and you got you got kind of like get out get in and get out um there's also these big crystals now i haven't <laughs> been able to successfully get one of these big crystals yet i don't know what they do we're not matchmaking by the way that's my info. Oh wait, I thought we were. We, we were, I think it just stopped. We're infiltrating. Oh. Is it Eats? I don't know when the full game's released, actually. I don't even think it says on Steam yet. I think they're just like letting people try it mm -hmm. out and seeing. But that's why they sponsored the stream today, which I thought was really nice. Yeah. Game. You look like Sonic on Acid. Come on. Uh, Alright, I'll do it, I'll do it again right away. Hang on, let me join your game first. new Telltale game that's being released. I heard there was one. There you go, I'm in. I'm in, and I'm infiltrating. Deets, please connect. Also, I just remembered something. <laughs> uh, this game is not available on Steam. Planned release date to be announced. Yes. Uh, so it's, it's basically... Yeah, the, the, you can download the demo. The demo's free. Um, have you seen the new Telltale game being released soon? It's called The Expanse, based on the Amazon TV show. Oh, they're releasing an Expanse TV show. Uh, uh, Telltale game. That's pretty cool. 
People love that show. I still haven't watched it. I actually watched the first two episodes and it was like so like a bit dry. It reminded me a bit of The Wire. And I didn't like The Wire either. I was like, the, I'm the only person in the world who doesn't like The Wire. Good. I've seen clips from The Wire, and I've been like, oh. but I'm just not a big fan of TV shows where everyone's an asshole. You know what I mean? Well, there it's about the police. They're all assholes. I know, I know, I know, but like everyone's an asshole. I'm, like, I'm, I'm always like, ah, oh, but I want someone to root for, man. But... Root for the guys on the street. They're going through it. But yeah, there are a lot of assholes. Come on, game. We're putting. We're both matching. I have not seen the Lower Deck season four trailer. See too. I'm very excited about Lower Deck. I saw. Four. I've seen clips of the. I still, you know, I haven't seen any of um, Brave New Worlds yet, and I, but I've seen clips on TikTok of um, Mariner and Boimler uh, getting it. Oh, dude, that looks so good! I'm so excited to watch it. I think me, me and Emily might have to start um, start watching Strange New Worlds. The crossover was funny as fuck. Yeah, that's what I've been hearing. It's a very cute little snake. It's like a little tube. It's a tube of seaweed. She's enjoying her stick right now. Strange yeah. New Worlds is brilliant. Yeah, I've heard really good things. I'm excited by it. We stopped killing and I started again. Yeah, that's fine. To make it remember Deets is out there. It's got a nice little beat in the menu though. Yeah, I should have my headphones on. Also, I turned my music down earlier, and I'm not sure if it's too quiet now. The music is nice. Let's go see if there's a snack for me. Bear back. Mm -mm. Chat. This is straight up the big roll. It is a grilled seaweed roll, and it's just got spicy, spicy sauce on it. I like a good stick too, Emily. Don't worry, it's all okay. I don't want to be judged for my consumption of stick. Ah, oh, Kingdom, that's so kind. Thank you. I'm happily, happily accepting a compliment. Um, yeah, it's funny because this is 11 calories, right? Because it's a piece of seaweed, right? It's actually really nice. And they, they literally cost 49p, which is correct because it's one singular piece of seaweed. But um, they're really spicy. Like, it like looks like it's for kids, but it's hot. Like, most people would find this too hot. Yeah, you can eat seaweed. Seaweed is um, nori. It's what's on the outside of uh, sushi. But you can eat loads of kinds of seaweed. You can eat seaweed in the UK. I really like seaweed. I think it slaps. But, still in the fountain for so long. Now I need a wee. Go PD. I'm just queuing and unqueuing. Fred, Fred and I might have to fight each other. I think um, the dream of, of just squatting up just isn't happening. But yeah, do you know what's funny? Is you're like, well, it's 11 calories. It's a tiny little tube. Cool. If you ate 100 grams of these, 100 grams, guess how much, how many calories you would eat? Because you're not, you're not ready for the facts of the matter. If you had 100 grams of these, and bear in mind each serving is 3 grams, you would have 370 calories of seaweed. And I was like, great Scott! How is that a thing? It's good though. It's real good. Oh, this is another... I actually might try one of these if yeah, I'm willing look. to share. Yes, of course. Um, I'm going to stop and start again. Begin! So, chat, I have got in my possession um, a little... This is tuna. Or oh, the worst possible timing! Crunchy onions, hot sauce, and a little nori wrap. What? I get it? Yeah, of course. <gasps> Yo, yeah, this was, this was an idea for... Um... How tight is that, Em? Toy, right? It's good shit. Who are we wrapping up? Who are we gonna play? Is it Deets? Deets, is it you? Mm. But wait, if it's 11 calories per stick and the stick is 3 grams, oh. 3 times 11, the math isn't math, but in, not baby. off by much. Oh, let's go! Alright, I don't suggest don't run straight towards. Mm -hmm. um, we <gasps> We're right next to each other. Yeah, we need to run sideways. I'm running sideways. Separate. We're gonna work together. Don't be detected. Obscene. All right, the hands are coming. Yeah. It's time to get underneath the trees and crouch. I'm under the trees. I can't even see these hands. Are they near you? They were coming straight towards the middle. Oh my god. <gasps> the illumination. 
I'm small. I turned the gamma on so the chat can see a little bit more. Is it? Is that my screen with gamma on? Yeah. My God. All right, fuck it. I'm going out. Chat deserve to see better than this. All right, the hands <gasps> are floating above me. These hands are too much. They're really waiting. They're looking at me. They're beaming right at me. I think you can sneak out. Yeah, no, it's he's like, they're like changing. Okay, okay. <gasps> Do not detect right, the one Stay crouched, love. stay crouched. Don't love any light. Uh-uh. I'm being detected. Wait, you can you get like a weird Ooh. I'm sneaking past the hands. I'm doing it. I think he spotted me. I got my first cell. Got my first cell too. Oh, no! I'm getting slapped. I'm getting slapped. What? I'm getting shot. Who the hell is shooting me? That's unacceptable. I don't know where the hands are. Well, I can't. Uh, they're above you and they are really coming down. I'm going to be honest, Fred. You are not looking great. Um, I think... It might be a good time to try and maybe get small, be a small cat, and zoom. still very visible. Though, that's the problem. I, I just, as a more experienced uh, escaper, oh wait, or oh, we could shoot God together. I mean, yeah, I think that's uh. I think it's time to shoot. I was trying to get as much as we can. I'm still not. We're mm -hmm. still on like one, one detect. Oh, he's right above me. Stay small. Remember when I carried Fred to win? <laughs> you literally carried him so hard. Oh, See, it shows that we can play together. I'm you carried I'm, him. I'm messing him up though. You're messing up God? Yeah, I died. No! I died. Okay, well, I'm fogging off. And I'm moving in the right direction. So that's good. Um, I'm moving sneaky, sneaky, quietly, quietly. The only issue is, it's really obvious what side I'm on because there's one side that's got no gems. And it's obviously the side I'm on. But we're just gonna try our best. Put all walls over here. Okay, I get up. Are you alive again? Yeah, I'm alive again. I'm, I'm getting collecting. Uh... Okay, God's looking. I am worried he saw me. He's coming over to me. <laughs> Idiot. He just instantly spotted me. Cheating. Man's a hacker. Oh wait, I can steal. Should I steal the necklace? Nexus. Okay. Well, you have aggro. He I'm spot stealing. Me. He spot me. Oh dear. Keep aggro. <laughs> get spotted. Oh God, is he coming? He's coming! He's on you. On my way. I would like for you to not do this. Please turn around. Ooh, that wasn't good. What's... What? I got slapped! Oh, the indignity! The indignity of the slap! The indignity! I'm getting slapped about. He's oh. good, he's good, he's got it. He knows the slap. Where's the actual hands? Because I want to shoot them. Whoa! Stop! 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 Whoa! Where's the Where's the real hands? Protect her down. I killed him. You killed him. I killed him from a distance. Fred, I love you so much. But that was most of my mm -hmm. ammo. That's fine. You stick with me, and I'll carry you. Is he back? My God, he's back! He spawned already. He's back quicker than ever. Yep. Right, get your hands out of my face. All right, I stole it halfway. Oh, that's not good. That is not good. Oh, these oh, trees boy. are not real. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Get the slapping. Mess with the clapper. You get the slapper. No. Dude, he's got too many slaps. I'm going to be honest. Wow! 99 slaps. Mm -hmm. It's too many slaps. If you haven't got problems, I feel bad for you, son. I got 99 slaps. Dude, I'm trying You're to shoot this button. man. I'm on fly flyer. I'm on flyer. 
Damn, this pistol bullets are too slow. Have you shot the hand of God? Oh, I got bounced. Dude, he's too much above me, and I'm too on fire. I know, right? It's so hard to aim mm -hmm. sometimes. He really is. Woo. He's dropping ice walls in here and there. I accidentally became a cat. Now I've been beaten as a cat. This is not what I wanted. Run, cat. I'm stealing? Run, small cat. Yes, 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 yes. Yeah, yeah, because I've got the aggro. Woo! I have the aggro. I'm a small cat. All right, as soon stop as you die, steal. I'm going to stop. I'm never going to die. I'm a cat with six HP. I'm never gonna die. You can catch me. Woo! Oh shit, I'm back. Oh shit! I still only have six HP. I was really hoping that was just cat stuff. I'm That's stealing. Fine. You've been stolen? Uh, it takes a while. I mean, yeah. So you couldn't even finish my steal. Three! I'm dead. Oh, that was really bad timing. But guess what? Now God is distracted. Oh, he put an ice wall right in front of me. Mm -hmm. He'll do that. Oh, dude, the splash damage on those fucking things is crazy. Oh, I just got slapped. Uh, I think I'm dead. I'm shooting. I got dead. I, sh I, I shot dead. him. No! I dead. But I shot him. Can you heal? Not that I know of. You can become a cat. So, like, you win some, you lose some. What are you even protecting? All right. Well, that level stole? five. You got the nexus. I think I did. So that's why the light comes on. Oh, All right. I'm going to protect you. I'm going to protect you. Get the portal. I protect. I attack. Most of all, I get exploded big style. The thing is, you can see our nameplates now. Mm -hmm. So it's like really obvious. I'm, I don't know if we're going to be able to do this. It's kind of crazy. I'm not going to lie. It's kind of crazy. All right. I'm 90 meters away. Yeah, ah, boy. I got, like, bounced. I'm shooting the hands to crazy amounts. I'm shooting them. Oh, okay. Oh, I'm out of bullets. That is Okay, I can't. It's got to be stun locked. I'm stun locked. I shot the hands! They're oh, dead. The okay. hands are dead. We need to move. The hands are dead. Let's go. Run, Fred, run. Clutch, 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 clutch. They're back. They're back already. Get in the trees. Get in the trees. Oh, I'm, I'm just hitting an invisible wall? I'm out of ammo, but the pistol ammo does hit. Oh, boy. All right, try and get to one of the exits, Em. Okay, I'm quite far. Oh, dear. Yeah, I've been running with you, so that's not great. I wonder if we can get ammo again. That would be so nice. Can I have more ammunition? Ah, oh, dude, the stun with the... Uh... Okay, I'm I'm setting up this portal. He doesn't even know. He doesn't even yeah, know. Yeah, yeah, get out. If you can, get out, get no, out. No, no, I'm not going to get out. I'm waiting for you. You got the Nexus, baby. No, I'm dead. You're not. You're not dead again. I'm dead. Fully dead. Get out, get out. Just jump straight through. Jump, 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 go. Aww. Once nice. again, Emily pogged off. Wow, what a performance. But unfortunately, Fred got murdered brutally. Mm -hmm. Yes. But I think if you could heal, you'd be very overpowered. Also, it seems like the key. A hey, space. Thank you for the... Rose, also soul, soul snipers. This game is called Asim Altered Axios. Uh, that was me, lol. I didn't notice the name tags. Yeah, ah. it's over life. It's really hard. I feel like there needs to be more time. Um, I think you need a bigger group. I think that the easiness, of, like I personally think solo, it's almost impossible to win. I agree. Let's queue up again. I'm a consumer of seaweed. GG to you too. Did you enjoy it? Was that your first game? That was fun, man. Mm -hmm. Cyber Yo! Live! Thank you for the Prime! Oh, he's got that Prime sub. Oh, yeah. We love to see it. Emily, it's completely impossible for me to get in a game with you. Why? How come? This tastes shit, good. This tastes shit, right? Yeah. Mm -mm. Maybe we can put it on screen space. What's that? The name of the game? Oh, sure, I can do that. Hang on. Let me just uh, go over here. Right, before we queue up, Fred's just going to pop that on screen. Is it this one? Nope, that's a different link entirely. Mm -hmm. This one. Mm -hmm. 
Jane really feels like he needs to tell you there are other infiltrators because I felt like I was 1v1 in the hands. Yeah, you probably were. You're not always teamed up with other people. I've done it solo. So, like, because, I mean, honestly, not very many. Yesterday, like, this morning when like I was checking this out. We maybe put sponsored under it or something, just so oh, that people sure. can't accuse us of not telling them it's sponsored. Yeah, can can we team you? Can we team up? Maybe Fred can make a team if he's got you. Yeah, I love you, sushi. If you want to join on me, that's more, more than welcome mm -hmm. to. Yeah, Deets, can you join on Fred? I'm happy for Lemons to join oh, yeah. too. I don't know if we'll. I don't know if there's four of us in group. If we'll ever actually be able to find someone to play with. Well, I mean, if um, Cyber Life wants to go uh, big hand again, then we can be got. Uh, he be was a big handing like crazy. That was funny though. You can queue hands. Sweet. Okay. Deets is him. And then Lemons can join on Deets. And we got a four man squad. Cyber Life. I don't know if that was your first round, but if it was, I just want to tell you to go up here to customize, mm -hmm. click on hand, no, and, then, tell them. <laughs> and then make sure that you put stuff down here. Yeah. Because you might go in this time and not have anything in there. It's happened to all of us that have played before. So you need to be like, explosions, please, and put them there. I like, I'd rather you didn't, but I mean, it's hardly a game if all you can do is look at us. I went in once with just a torch and one nuke. Not the best. So I think if you open your Steam friends list and then you right click on Deets and you say join her game, it should let you. No, no, it's fine. Okay. Go for it. Uh, try the dragon roll. Blues told me about it. And uh, me and the lady love sushi and it's absolutely amazing. Yo, we got lemons, right. We have a four squad. We have one cat. I feel like we all need to try and become cats at the same time. Deets! <laughs> it does look like you. It really does look like you. Holy moly. Yeah. So, we've got Fred. We've got Deets. We've got Lemons. I'm going to wait for Fred to come back with his beverage. And then we are going to queue. And we're going to try and get both Nexiums. I think with four people, if we don't get both, we've flopped. We've flopped. We're a flop nation. If we don't get opinion. both, we're flop nation. But yeah, I don't know why. Personally, I don't know why the thing was done like that. Like, why you have to keep adding in what you want. But I assume over time, yeah. you could get new types of weapons. Well, I guess it's just like, you so know. You could do different builds with the hands. And you got to kind of be like a bit conservative with your, like, your builds and stuff like that. Like, you can't just keep slapping. But you might, yeah, you can't just keep couple them cheeks. You might want to like conserve it a little bit, you know? Best game ever. Lego Star Wars. The Lego games rule. Yeah, They're the Lego really games are really good. good. Games. Mm hmm I'm very excited. Chat, thank you for joining us in this. It would have been fun if it was just me and Fred, but it's way more fun when more Oh, people. it's way better of you guys. Oh, uh, there was a Pirates of the Caribbean one. Literally almost everything Pirates of the Caribbean after <clears throat> film one was bad. Yeah. It's actually weird, right? Because obviously I look back at Pirates of the Caribbean with rose-tinted glasses because it came out in an era when I was a kid and it was really cool and exciting. Oh, shit. But at the same time, a lot of the stuff that I really liked as a kid still stands up. Like, damn, I was right about Sean Paul. You know what I mean? Pirates of the Caribbean was a great action movie. There really aren't that many great action movies like that anymore. And so it's one of those things where, like, I feel kind of, like, silly. But are you putting me in the hands? I'm doing a little <laughs> bit of bullying, yeah. I can't remember that. Ooh. I should not have done that. Wow, we killed that! Protect her down! Yo, that was bully. That was completely pointless. There's no benefit to us to do that. Yeah, I was, trying to, I was just trying to get him low health. <laughs> oh, we shouldn't have killed him. Well... Yeah, no, I'm thinking about it now, like, tactically, and I'm like, what was the deal? Oh my god, I'm gonna get the ball. It's gonna happen. The ball! Dude, I want the ball. You know I do. She didn't even use it. That's so sad. If you look at the ball and press F, it goes off. So you just gotta get as many of these um, yeah. cells as possible. Mm -hmm. We're gonna strip this place clean! 
Oh yeah. Oh yeah. The stuff you put in didn't save? Oh no. Oh no. Do you want us to restart? Have then? you only got slaps or something? Yeah, what do you have, Sober Life? Do you have enough stuff to get through? Or, because as I said, I once went in with just a nuke. You got three slaps. Do you have any other stuff? That's it! Ah! Ah! <laughs> I tell you what, you get your three slaps off and we'll restart, okay? We may need to reconvene the entire group, but that's not a big deal. Oh, I got slapped. I'm sure Lemons is oh, deep listening. Yeah, maybe we should all stand here and get the triple or the quad slap. The omnipotent quad slap. Hi, Clue. Are you smelling tuna? You cannot have it. It is not for Florence. Yes. What? I got a nice block on my head. Mm -hmm. On your head? On my head. Right. Okay, well, I think you may be out of slack. So I think I'm going to back out. Right. I'm backing out. I can't back out. I think we all have to close the game. They killed him. Um, I guess we can complete it. We can complete, we can just get the, uh... Okay, the... well, we'll get the Nexus, we'll get out, and then we'll requeue, and that will give you a second to... Cyber Life, that will give you a second to get your stuff on your character. Sweet. Let's observe. <laughs> not spreading the news. Parents, this game's much easier when no one's trying to kill you. <laughs> Nexus obtained. Do I smell like tuna? Level 5 alert. Oh, I got bonked. Oh my god, you did. You damaged. Mate, we might die of our own accord. <laughs> Get to the portal. So the mini-map at the top, you can see where the closest portal is. Yeah, except that time that you ran into a wall and I followed you. That wasn't a good time. Can I respring the spring? It's a one you spring. It's pretty fun, though. Ah. Uh... This is suck! Said, hey Dave, what is this stuff? Is that me? Yeah, he's giving up. He's got nothing left. He's got nothing left. I hit, I hit him a lot. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you get him. Oh bloody hell! These rocks are really a pain in the ass. Got hands. I'm free. Needs escape. Family escape. I just stopped running. I can't even get up there. Everyone else is escaped. Right. I'm gonna die. Emily lost. Mm -hmm. You got your head up the hills, then. Head up the hills. Running up that hill. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, I was trying. It was just bloody stuff. What? Stop spotting me so yeah, hard. Yeah, every time you get spotted, he Stop spotting me so he's, hard. He's, he's like, you, I'm yeah. observing the hell out of you. That dude's in the gym today. I'm observing. Ooh. Emily was getting. So we're doing deadlifts today, chat, and Emily, uh, there's some guys who like kept on going around the long way, uh, around all the all the stuff to sort of like, you know. Oh, you guys already ate them. Oh, so yeah, ready. they were observing real hard, is all I'm saying. I actually got the funniest video, and it's Fred just recorded me for like a second, but rather than me doing a deadlift, it's just my ass. Um, and I'm really tempted to tweet it out and be like, when you ask him to, <laughs> when you ask him to record you at the gym, because I think people will find it funny. Observing. Observing. Yeah, exactly, exactly. <laughs> um, right, let's collect up the squad again. Fred, can you join on me? I will once I let mm -hmm. me. Yeah, yeah, no stress. I will instantly do it. Deets is already in. Oh, I'm in. Oh, we're Deets. all together again. Nice. If I only could make a deal with the deeds. Okay. We got the squad? We got the squad. Yeah, so make sure you go into your um, customize. Make sure you give yourself loads of stuff as well. Very important. Give yourself loads of stuff. Yes. Well, I don't need to do that, do I? Because hmm? I'm just a... Oh. What in the rocket launcher? Smoke grenade? Oh. Extra gun? I love more gun. Oh, you've got an extra gun? Mm -hmm. What the heck? Mm-hmm. <laughs> How'd you get an extra gun? 
There's got some more. I could have even more guns than that. Do I have more guns? What the f mm -hmm. I saved it. Add the rocket. Alright, fine. I'll add the rocket instead of the gun. Confirm. If I only could. Are we all ready to infiltrate? Well, I'm ready to infiltrate. Mm-hmm. It's all right, Cyber Life. I won't bully you too hard. Fred oh Rich is being God. toxic. There's hyper escape mode C2. Uh... Here we go, here we go, here we go. You guys going to tweet this out? And be like... <laughs> <laughs> Because when you're deadlifting, there isn't really a good angle. No, it's fine. You didn't. No, it's, Did, do you know, think yeah. it's funny? You're not in with me. What? What? We're no! in. We're in with some strange hands. No! My God. Okay. Chat. We got. We, guys, we got to do this. Okay. Oh Lord, we're really in. I should put my headphones on. Really. Oh no, my audio is still on. <laughs> Bully the strange hands! Will do. I should really stop sprinting. Oh, he totally saw me. Yeah, whatever. I'll just shoot you. Blah, blah. Oh, and I can become a cat. Wow! Okay, I got myself. Okay, I got myself spotted pretty bad, to be honest. Oh, he's attacking you, I think. Mm -hmm. Rocketing. You call him yeah. Elton I'm John. already nearly dead? Well, how did you do that? He's attacking me. I said no one. I, I don't know Yo, how I'm nearly down. I'm trying my, to work that out myself. He just broke my spinal. My spine is not in a good way. I should not have been sprinting. Oh my god, I'm being... Oh no. The irony. I was supposed to bully the hands. Four. Right, two. I've got the hands really low. Oh. I should have seen it. I'm on 2 HP and I'm feeling good. Oh, I'm on 7. What? What did I die of? Old I age? died. I died of old age. Oh, you're right next to me, I think. Oh, God, I jumped on one of those traps. Why are they so invisible? Oh, my entire body. Okay, I'm going to kill this hand. I'm pissed off. I've had enough of you. Also, I'm gonna collect some little gems. Still relatively unspotted though, which is the best part. Yeah, well, that's what started it. You were spotting the heck out of me. All right, it's nice to know that I can sprint when he's not looking at me. Yeah, this game is definitely for more than more yeah. than. Which I guess makes sense why they offered us the sponsor thing. They were like, well, at least with two people you could play, and maybe you'll get more. Because <laughs> they didn't ask us to like tell you guys to play or anything. I just made sense, you know. Yeah. I don't even know. I, I think I'm lost. You're lost. Okay. Okay. Oh my god, he's already blown up this house. That's stressful. Can you go in a post blown up house? Okay, Deets is heading towards the extraction, the nexus, which means that we need to distract the hands. The hands on me right now. How are you doing? Okay. Should I come and shoot the hand? No, I mean, you guys You guys do steal. Okay, good point. Oh, the hands are not on me anymore? Okay, I'm running towards lemons and deeds. In the hope. That I can assist. Furries on screen? Ah, uh, Fred is being a little bit of a furry. I'm a little kitty cat. Fred's like, I don't understand all this furry stuff. Very strange. Anyway, I'm a little kitty cat. Meow. It's like, hmm. Mm -hmm. Seems like you may have gone to the bottom of that one. Oh, hi, Wooden. How are your hands? Oh. Okay, I killed God. Check it down. I killed God. He was pissing me off. Giving too much. So that should Where? give Deets a bit less pressure Where on. Where is the, uh... Wait, what thing? if I steal as well? I just got ice cubed. Am I, I think Deets and I are stealing at the same time. Good. Uh, I'm a bit on fire, but I'm cool. I'm not going to stop stealing. Oh, you guys are over there. Okay, I need to head that way. Ow, my ass. Yeah. Okay, I may have made it worse, not better. Deets, 
tactically have I made things much worse? Hey Flo, I'm sorry about the lack of tuna for you. I'm steal from here. I'm stealing! They're like distract him! I'm distracting, I'm shooting him. Everyone's shooting him! Woo! Bully those hands! He's coming over, he's gonna smash! He's fucked it up, he's smashing others! He didn't even notice. I stole the Nexus! All right, time to get out of here. I got me a fat nexus. All right, I've lit him up a little bit. He's smashing me. If anything, you just sent me further in the right direction. Ow. I'm smashing through buildings. Explain that. Okay, I'm running to open the portals. <laughs> Shut hand. Yeah, he's really low. Yeah, he's, he's slapping up some others. Hey, if you come towards me, mm -hmm. I'm going to have a Oh, I am. <laughs> Look away. Oh, Wild Lemon's Look died. Look away. It's okay. She'll be fine. Don't be detected. Well, I failed that one. <laughs> oh, he's on me. Mm -hmm. Dude. Yeah. I think this the hands had skin. Oh, God. Well, he just really... I just got... Chiropractored. Shattered. Smashed in off. Wait, did we just get the other Nexus? I think so. Yo! Wait, 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 wait. Well, now he's spawn camping mm. the uh, the exit. Not if I shoot him with a rocket, maybe. I've got his full attention, though. If I only could. Oh, he's on you. Did the rocket hit? I can tell. Is meteoring. Oh! Oof. I was the meteor. Alright, Lemons is fully dead. No, Lemons! How's Deets? Okay, we gotta bully this hand. Alright, portal's open over here, Em. Come to me, come to me. I'm coming. I'm coming! Yeet. Oh my god, he's blowing you up. Over no, no, it's actually me for a smoke grenades. Oh my god. Whoa. Right, okay. Run, run, run. We're through. Nexus! Oh! Steal two of two! Oh! Yeah! Oh, baby! I died for the cause, Lemons. You did! Let's fucking we did go! It. Let's go, squad! Team work. Mm. You couldn't handle multiples. Dude, that's so... That, I'm not gonna lie, when I saw the second Nexus, I was like... Oh yeah, that's what I said. Well, that was good. We we, we, uh, we went in, we saw, we conquered, mm -hmm. it was great. Happy days. Yeah, should I, I was, uh, should I tweet this out? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's like... <that's> like... <laughs> Chat, I posted something humorous. Do you want to see it? You can. Uh, do we have the full squad? Oh, yeah. I need a button for the boys are back in town, baby. Oh, the it is the boys are back. top of the hour. Oh, what, you're not top a of the anymore? Hour. If you would like to win at the top of the hour giveaway, all you got to do is make sure you're following. Type in exclamation mark. Enter. If you are a tier two... <clears throat> you can buy extra guns and stuff in the shop with your cubes. What? My cubes? Hang on. Where's so... the shop? The store. <gasps> oh my god, you can. Can I be an aardvark? You can be a rhino. An armadillo? A rhino? A little kitty cat? But yeah, tier 2 and tier 3 subs. Um, check to see if you won anything. And obviously you're automatically entered. Yo, we can buy more buildings. So you know when they're like, you can fix up your town and make it look how you want. Look at all these buildings you can buy. I know. It's, uh, man, it's crazy. Mm, I like being a kitty cat, though. Is that wrong? <coughs> Is it no, so wrong of it's me? Not wrong. It's not wrong. Oh, and that's how you buy 
So that's also how you buy your god hands and stuff. So you use your gems. Okay, so if I go into customize. I still got all my good stuff. Excellent. I'm happy. Uh, are we ready to go? I'm ready to go. Fred is ready. Lemons and deets, give me a ye in the chat. Or a mm -hmm. y or a thumbs up. So that I know you're done uh, adjusting. Adjusting. Well, I'm house flipper. No, we still play it. I mean, we haven't played in a while. Yeah, we haven't played in a what while. What a variety but... stream, you see, darling. What happened to House Flipper? I mean, I don't know. Are you asking in general, or like, what happened? Like, with, like, I don't know. Let's go. House Flipper's still a game, as far as I know. Sorry, was becoming Rhino. Don't not stress. I was hoping somebody was going to do it. Also becoming Let's Rhino, dude. Rhino pals. <laughs> You've got that. You've got that top energy. <laughs> Fun Epic Games account fact, if you've mm. been locked out of the email address tied to your account, no worries. They have a recovery system that requires you to tell them you can't access the account anymore. So they send you a new verica verification email to the fucking account you can't access. Oof. You think you got the hands this time? Okay. Okay, okay. Save a life. Cool. That's, that's sick. We'll try and play it more sneaky this time and less aggressive. Yeah. Maybe. Maybe. We'll see how we'll things see. turn we'll out. See we'll see how, how it pans out. out. Remember, we're friends the rest of the time. But right now... But yeah, Baz, you won the Hollow Knight, which is such a fun game. Hi, Lemons. Looking cute, babes. Everyone be quiet, be sneaky. Deets has been spotted. Oh, no. You should put on... I will use this as an opportunity to escape myself. Escape. It's escape time. Escape, escape time. Ronald Stealth failed! As always, as it always does. The daily oops, I can't do stealth. Hey, robots, are you ready for blap, blap, blap? Oh, what? What kind of four tap robot is this? This is usually a two tap situation. French, do you respond to blah, blah, blah? Blah, blah, blah. Do you For consider like, that I'm your here. Gangster. Mm. Gang, gang. <laughs> gang, gang. Gang, gang. Gang, gang. Gang, gang. Wait, no. I think it's so funny that like that NPC woman thought that GG meant gang, gang. Yeah. Unfortunately, she's already made many enemies. Who? That woman. Really? Why? Because she was all like, yo, Hollywood, I'll take your roles. And everyone was like, stop being so uh... desperate. Like no. it's cool. It's cool to be like, yo, I want. You to can't be work. a scab, man. But don't be a scab. That's gross. Stop. Dude, that that ain't cool. So frankly, the cubes are only for the matter of unlocking new stuff. I should be focusing on the nexus because I've already got fat cubes. Many would say. What's up with the NPC woman? Basically, I don't know if you've met, missed this era of TikTok, but she was all like, yo, I'm gonna do pretend to be an NPC on TikTok lives and get gifts. Um, basically, it's just a way of react to money. It's it's a thing that Twitch streamers invested a long time ago. Yeah, I do. Oh, got these hands. You gotta catch these hands. Ow, I caught the hands. Oh no, when you do that to yourself, it's very embarrassing. So, oh, someone Protect killed me. Protect it down. Mm-hmm. I would. I didn't Give even. Give that bitch a rocket launch. Yeah. So basically, she's now been on TikTok back being up. like, I'll, I'll be a scab. And, right, well, you think you've got a problem. I've somehow run into the crevice. Uh-oh. I've got the hands on me at the Nexus. Someone has got a Nexus. I'm going to go get the other one as a cat. I've been very helpful. Oh, I'm getting blown the fuck up. You're getting what? Sorry, that was inappropriate. I shouldn't have said it. Cock, I was so close. That was also inappropriate, to be honest. Two for two. Protect it down. Cut him again. Let's get this Nexus, baby. Steal. Come on, we're doing it as a squad. She, we're going to be unstoppable. Oh, I flamethrowed me. Ah, oh, I died. He picked on you. Yes, he did. Come on, Em, you got this, you got mm -hmm. this. I'm so He doesn't stuffy. even know you're there, he knows you're there. He's noticed. I'm frozen? 
It happens. Oh my god, I'm frozen. Ow, my booty cheeks. Ooh, I got the Nexus, but I died. In a very poetic oh, dude, moment nothing. of ultimate justice. Oh my god, he's slapping ah. the place! <laughs> he's like doing bongo basics up in here. It's really not a lot. Once they decided to slap you, there's not a lot you can do. Quote to ah. Emily for inappropriateness. Oh, you can't do it because you're not slap. That's what you get. <laughs> once you once you get slapped, mm -hmm. the slap combo is mm -hmm. impossible to get out of. Oh my god, Deets has opened a friggin' Nexus. And Nexus is open. She's done it. She's the ultimate gamer. Wee. May I be the first? How can he slap a classic? I mean, it was a good question. How can she slap? And the answer is she should not have. It was not profesh. But it was funny. Ugh. Okay, I'm escaping. Protect him down. Oh my god, Fred! Fred's out here in a fight with Ward. I'm fighting God. Solo. How'd it go? I uh, got bounced in the sky. Uh, yeah, medium. Booty's got clapped. Oh, yeah. Fred is literally experiencing a full scale. Um... I think. Ooh. Oh, no. Oh, God's really coming and he's furious. Babe! I thought if he's dead three times, he's dead, you know, but now he's back. Okay, this is good. This is good. This is good. If anything, you've helped me. You idiot! You slapped me right into the portal! Escaped! Two stolen! I'm Fred's a cat! I'm a kitty, yeah. Meow, 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 meow. Killed everyone once, which in an honest and just world would have been enough. Back to being a smelly human again. Well, he can see my nameplate, so I don't know what I'm doing. Slapping. Beats is still hanging out. She's trying to protect you. She's giving you the smoke. He's giving you the skibbity paps. Skibbity paps. Who's gonna win? Smoke versus the paps. Oh my god, it's not even the open one. One of them was open. I did. Oh. Should be open. Opening. Keep pressing F. What? F. I blacked out, I think. No, the game broke. Oh, the, the game, game broke. broke. Oh, wait. Okay, we're back. But I think the portal it's open, is it's open. open. It's open. It's open. It's open. Oh! That, oh! that was good. Okay, that's cool, that's cool. Yeah, chat. If you want to have a chance to play God and clap Fred's cheeks, you can download the game and the, the demo for free. Yeah. You ran out of slaps? <laughs> Side of life, man. Me and you won't be one. It was hilarious. That was a good round. That was very good. Congratulations. Cyber Life, I know you lost, but you were playing against a lot of people, so... And you killed us all a bunch. And that was very good. I actually think, think that was very fun. Possibly refill me with water. Of course. I just want to get my tuna bowl away. It's the gamer's favorite spell. Deeds! She's gone. I want to stop a you ever played over Kelly? Okay, that was fun as hell. I'm really glad, Deets. Thank you for joining. Well, we still got Friend and Lemons. If anyone else has felt inspired and wants to play, you can. I hope nobody heard that. Noisy, creaky. Otherwise, we're going to have to queue for a while and see if somebody shows up. Or one of us will have to play God. But I'll queue us for a bit and see if somebody shows up. We cool with that? Yeah. Uh, I'm putting two lots of slaps no. in this time. Uh, the slapping is like mm. impossible sometimes, unless you can get a good mm. dodge. Well, Tommy, actually, if I can cancel this for a second, um, you can actually edit your world. Yeah. So you can actually like change it, put the nexuses where you want, like basically make it how you want to play on it. Yeah, you can you can change the world however you like. Anyway, uh, except for ripping off my splint by accident, we're hoping my nail regrows, and if it never does, I hope this one never falls off. Oh, God. 
Uh, you can't end up nailless. That's gross. Hey, Elder Thea, we're doing great. How Elder are you? Thea, good to see mm. you. Chat, Ch thank you very much for everyone tuning in today. Thank you very much for the uh, 20 subscribers today. We are 14 subs away from our goal of 700. Mm -hmm. Only 14 away. No, okay. not again. But Cyber Life, I'm going to be honest. Most of the time, when I try and join with someone, I'm sure it'll grow back, though. I'm yeah. sure it'll grow back, Code. A fleshy nub. What finger is it, Wooden Code? What finger is it? Yeah, which one? Okay, we're in. It actually loaded. Well, after this round, I'm very happy to queue with you again. <clears throat> Not a cursed wedding finger. Elrithir, yo, thank you very much, Elrithir. Thank you for the resub, you're a legend. And Elrithir mm -hmm. says, wow. it should say, okay, fine. <laughs> I'm so proud that you were so inspired. You're like, wow, that'll do. <laughs> Deets! Deets gifting five. Mm. Thank you, Deets. Deets said, we need more free games today, baby. Yeah, Dude, like, thank there you has that. been that was so a fun. lack mm -hmm. of free games. Mm -hmm. And that is unacceptable. Chat, you would like to win a free game. Make sure you're following anti Big Oh, Yay, it's just everything's just doubling it's just again. It's doubling. I don't know why it's repeating, mm -hmm. it just is. Woo! Is he on you? I was on lemons. No, he's on lemons. He's on lemons right now, which made me think, right, I'm going to go to the Nexus. And I'm going to try and get the thing. That's what I was thinking. I was thinking the same thing. And oh, my God. Because I'm like, right, if we get the Nexuses, then we can team back up with lemons. I am in your game. It is you, Cyberlife. Well, now it's time to attack. It's time to kill. Anyway, don't listen. Shh. Cover your ears. You heard my strategy. Great, now you're the bloody Nexus. You weren't in the Nexus before. Smell o vision. Ow, my ass cheeks. Right, that's it. I'm shooting you. If I only could, why am I on fire? Explain that to me. Holy moly. Oh, friend, I got aggro. Do with that what you will. Okay, okay. Ah! I'll try, I'll try him. Oh! Things are looking rough for him. Things Sorry. have never been worse. Things are getting worse. Come here, you bloody hand. Nope, not that. Honestly, the fact that the hand has power of hand is ridiculous. <laughs> why power get the hand? Third hand. Yeah, literally, why you got more hands? Eh? Explain that to me. Hey! Uh, Oh no! Tomorrow Fred has to play Dead by Daylight and he has to get traumatized by Nicholas Cage. Alright, run to the pause, everyone run to the pause. We got them both? About to. Also, everything's doubled! Let's go! I'm running to the portals. I'm gonna get the portal open. I'm helping! Right. Uh, yes! Tomorrow works. Uh, I'm not in till three. Okay, we will not uh, be too late then. What the? I, don't I don't know what know time what's... three is to you, but you okay? Yeah. I'm in a pickle. Yeah, just in a pickle. Mm -hmm. I keep on getting frozen. I can't see the hands, and I'm getting constantly getting slapped. Mm -hmm. This, I'm not gonna lie. The slapping <laughs> is uh, a little OP. A little OP. <laughs> it doesn't hurt that much though. If you heading towards me? Because can't right now. Somebody is getting. Somebody's getting slapped. Protect it down. Nice. Portal open. Fred, on the way. On the way. I would like to. But no one's rolled a ball on anyone yet, and that's very sad. 
Oh, did you become a rhino? Oh, I not you yet. You didn't even oh, apply your rhino. You didn't apply it. Oh, that sucks. Tomorrow we're gonna be good. Deep, we just got 700 sub points. Yeah, if somebody could tell me what time 3 p.m. is in Texas. Um, but yeah, we will. Uh, we'll get Fred and my death by daylight. <laughs> Fred is getting I chased. I died. What if I leave? Is that good? Yeah, you can leave. But like, Unless you want to shoot will, will the guy I take for the me. I have been. I just wasn't sure if that would ensure our nexus. In. I've been shooting him a lot. I don't even know what the fucking hands are. They're over me. Oh. I'm a flame. What's happening? I wonder if you can see me through the trees <laughs> while on fire. But I got the full attention. The woogly one, Meeple Station. Meeple Station is bogus, says Deeps. Protect uh, it down. An experienced Meeple player. Very Meeple-ulous. Um, I'm opening up my own portal. Jump my, through, I'm jump through. My portal closed. Oh shit, come to me. I waited too long. Oh no. I was waiting all that time for you. And now the hands are back and I'm dead. It's over for me. No, you nah, got this, you got this, nah, you got this. Nah. Oh no. If anything, that helps. You fool. Oh, lemons are still up, mm. lemons are still up. Come oh. on, that was so close. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> Oh, we only got uh, one out of two. Still good, though. Yay! A respectable performance. A singular... You know, not bad. Could have been worse. <sighs> What's your opinion on Henry Cavill being kicked off the Witcher series? He was kicked off? Yeah, um, well, he got I forced he out. I thought he left. Um, no. Why? Well, he did leave, but it was more sort of like... Get out of here. Uh, you know when you know when you know when couples say it was a amicable breakup. It was a bit like that. We haven't talked about the most unamicable breakup. What? SpongeBob SquarePants. SpongeBob SquarePants. So, the guy who played SpongeBob SquarePants in um on stage in Broadway, which was a real musical. He is now in another mu musical film adaptation called Into the Woods, okay? It's being filmed in the UK. Also in this adaptation is Ariana Grande. Ariana Grande has a w husband. He has a wife. This wife and him have been together for 10 years. They are high school sweethearts. They just had a kid together. The kid is under a year old. He calls up his wife. By the way, I'm dumping you within 10 seconds is with Ariana Grande. Very bad. Ariana. His wife had no idea. His wife was literally like, um, what? Yeah, of course you can cyber life. We'll have to queue for a bit, but that's fine. Uh, how do, yeah, I, cyber do, life. I, how do I get you in? Uh, um, how do I do my friend code thing? We'll get you a friend code. Um, if anyone else wants to play the big hand and slap us around, you will welcome the game. Or we will just uh, we can sit in the queue. I think there's a few, couple more people yeah. playing now. So I'm hoping. So... Yeah, I'm just saying. Like. Yeah, yeah, of course, of course, of course, course. It's a spot. Um... So, um, yeah, Ariana Grande has got with this guy. Like he's like tweeting out like Happy Mother's Day to my wife. You're the best Jesus. mom in the world. Blah blah blah. I've been with you for ten years. Um, and yeah. So, turns out Ariana's like, oh yeah, bye husband. They've actually been broken up since like January or in the process of breaking up. But they've only been together like three minutes. But this guy literally got like a phone call <clears throat> and then within like a day it's in the newspapers. Neither of their like teams have said anything about it because obviously nobody knows what to say. But apparently this is like the fourth or fifth guy that Ariana Grande's got with that she nicked off somebody else. So apparently getting with Taken dudes is like a thing for her. Which is ah, kind of crazy, life. right? Yeah, that's that's mm -hmm. crazy. But yeah, I don't know why Henry Cavill will be kicked off The Witcher. I mean, well, basically, the he left because of the, of a, of um, creative differences, right? Yeah. And um, it was because oh yeah, but he was being aggro, right? In the sense that he was like, "You should follow the books," and they were like, 
Well, they were also making fun of the author and and the books, like like in the writing room. And he was like, "Yo, I'm a really big fan of this stuff." Like, yeah, I didn't join. The this. reason why I started this this entire show is because I'm a fan of the books. Yeah. And they're like, "Why? The books are shit." And he's he's like, oh. "Okay, yeah, that's really cringe." I'm not gonna lie, I do think that probably stuff like that happens more often than we think, and I'm always surprised by the fact that like people will work on shows they have like no passion for or no actual interest in and they're just like yeah if I, this does well it's a real leg up for me yo but yeah all right sex on the qm broadway spongebob yes broadway spongebob um also weirdly he looks exactly like her brother like that is strange exactly it the whole thing is so weird let me see if i can find it that is really frankie weird. grande Sure, Blues. Um, boom. Okay, so that didn't help because Frankie Grande has a boyfriend. Damn it. Frankie Grande looks <clears throat> like. Because I don't know what the hell friggin' SpongeBob's name is, but everyone's been putting them side by side. Her new bo. Her new. Boyfriend is the spitting image of. Oh my god, it's actually really uncomfortable. Uh, um, Zwarte, no, we've been, um, we get into a couple of lobbies here and there. Yeah. But we've had, we've been had people in our chat basically kind of like, oh my god, that is. Those weird. are different men, and one of them is her boyfriend, and one of them is her brother. I can only tell they're different because basically the teeth. Yeah. That's the only difference. Isn't that weird as hell? Like, that's, re that's really close. Like, mm, but yeah, Zwarte, we basically sketch. have been, um, sort of a, like, Telling our uh, viewers to like come play and yeah, beat the hand together. and stuff like that. Uh huh. But I, I, but yeah, it's not been. Um, I don't think that many people are playing it right now because obviously it's in like alpha mm -hmm. or beta. Or whatever yeah, it is. it's yeah, it's small. But yeah, the smile is exactly the same. Yeah, that's but weird, if you man. queue as protector, we've got four infiltrators, so we we might be grouped together if you uh, at X Water if you want to join. Yeah, so Ariana Grande is dating the lookalike of her brother, and it has broken up like it seems like a bunch of relationships. Ariana Yo, Grande, look, look at him! Ah, kiss, kiss, kiss. I met some very cute cats today. Oh yeah, we we mm -hmm. did meet some cute cats today. Mm -hmm. Thank Christ, my ex-wife wasn't the spitting image of my gender bearded brother. <laughs> Yeah, the whole thing's very strange. I was very like, what in the world? Yeah, oh god, imagine if you look like Bill or something. Bill, my brother Bill looks like a Lego character. If I look like your brother. Yeah. Like, no. Bill looks like a fucking Lego. You know, if no. you cross the Lego character with a tennis ball, that's my brother Bill. It's terrible. He's like the, he's like truly an unattractive man. So, X Water, if I'm queuing here, right? If you click here and start match, you might be against us. Mm hmm. Um, the only thing I will say is if you come up here and you go, so click on this, go into customize protect and make sure you've got a bunch of different stuff down here. So put like this here and then click confirm. Because if you don't, you may end up with nothing to slap or throw. Nothing to slap. Does nothing that make slap sense? With. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So, so you, you got to make sure you replenish. Get your hands weaponized and then press start, match start, and then hopefully... We will all be able to play together. And don't, and don't forget to click save when you move your guns around. Space, thank you for all the roses and Spaced. the TikToks and the hearts today. You're really appreciated. Thank you, Space. Mm -hmm. Space, even not Space. Speaking of clicking, yeah, chat, if you want to try this Click game out link. or play with your friends, obviously there aren't that many people playing it right now, so I would recommend, like, if a few of you guys want to play it later, you can jump mm -hmm. into Discord and play together. You're kind of probably going to want three of you. One to be the hand. At least, yeah. Two three, to yeah. be the infiltrator. That's pretty much what learn I would Learn the maps. Say. Learn how to, like, play yeah. all the different stuff. It's really good. Yeah, you can also edit your world and, like, build your own maps. You could have, like, big balls everywhere and stuff like that. Um, but, yeah, you can check it out. I think it's really fun. Uh, yeah, we have a Discord server. It is discord.gg slash family. Yeah. Or exclamation mark Discord. Or there's a link below. But yeah, come join. 
and people, you know, they play games in there together and stuff, so it's nice. Yeah, it's actually one of the really nice things about about like setting up a Discord is that you go in there every now and again, and there's just a uh, people in like a voice com mm -hmm. uh, and a voice channel all together, just playing video games. And I'm like, that's wholesome as hell. That's not nice. the only reason they know each other is because of us. It is me. It was me. It was me. <laughs> Hey, the whole alien thing today was crazy, man. <laughs> aliens, aliens! chat! Aliens! We got aliens! I can't even believe it. I'm honestly in shock. Come on, baby. Come on, next water. Okay. I got a small squad right now, too. Ah, oh, shit. That sucks. Aliens! Yeah, we got it. We got, we got some So aliens. we've just got no one playing protector. We're just all queuing as infiltrators. Oh, well, that's fine. I'll wait. I'm sure yeah, somebody... Yeah, I don't mind waiting. I'm sure somebody will at some point. And if not, I mean, I could... I don't mind leaving and being the big hand and you and Lemons. I just think that two versus one experienced hand. A hand of the world, you could say. I don't know if you've got any hope. A hand of the world. Kill you. To shreds, you say. To shreds. Um, odds don't take. I only know uh, about Simmer because of Fremily. Well, that's a bad thing. Oh, I'm, I'm so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Take this one. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. I actually love Simmer. Yeah, Simmer's awesome. I'd never say that about somebody I didn't love. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> but Simmer's British. He gets it. He he knows the, mm -hmm. the, the, the crack. Americans sometimes don't get the crack. Simmer's not even American. Is he not? He's no, I said he's British. So he understands. Oh, right. I get you. I thought you meant. I thought you said he's not even English, and I was like, "What? What? What? No, he's definitely English." Have we met Simmer in real life? Nah, I don't think so. I feel like I'd remember if I had. I was like, "Whoa! Whoa! Who's this crazy guy?" Oh my god, chat! We're doing another mug meetup. It's happening in September. Don't ask me any more details than that. I will not be answering any more questions. I barely want. I'm barely organizing it. I think to Dom's be organizing it. Of course he is. Yeah. He's trying to collect a harem. <laughs> the last one went well for him. No, the I'm last just one was very successful. <laughs> Um, but yeah, if you guys are free during the month of September and you want to meet up, yeah. we will be meeting up somewhere in London. That's basically the story. Sop, sop Tombre. I think we have a date that we agreed to. It's some sort of a Saturday some in early September. <laughs> and we will probably, if the weather's good, probably meet in the park again because it's free. Yeah, a little you bring repeat. your own food. And if the weather's bad, we'll meet in a pub. Woo! The classic, ooh, the classic English... What do you want to do? Pub? Yeah. Pub. Pub. We'll go pub. Yeah, we'll go pub. I'll go pub. Do you want to go pub? Yeah, I'll go pub. <laughs> Last night from Dom was the end of August. Uh, would work for him. And then he said he was going to try and get something set up this week. And then he went quiet. We agreed some dates in chat one time. I was being peer pressured by chat. I th I can't remember who it was. Maybe Spider Mooses. Was like, girl, when are we doing this? And I was like, ah! Help! Oh yeah, we do. We do. Everyone who's coming to the meetup, we do require you to be eighteen plus. Yeah, you Cause got. Because you got to be... go to the pub. Yeah. Also, I'm mm -hmm. not meeting up with uh, anyone who's younger than eighteen because I am not. Uh, not that I ever would, but I'm not putting myself in a Ballinger esque situation where I'm yeah. around a bunch of kids. You know what be I mean? Yeah, growing up. I don't. But, yeah, I thank you for appreciating that cyber life. It's no, really that's sweet. cyber life. It's cool, man. Yeah. You're more than welcome to. Mm -hmm. Yeah. No. Awesome. Mm -hmm. You're more than welcome to watch stream and hang mm -hmm. out and stuff like that. But. Um, but yeah. Also, we just don't want to. Basically, if you're younger, then, like, we got to be responsible to make sure that, like, you know, if you're a grown-up, you can be like, I'm fucking pissing off, I'm done with you lot. Whereas when you're a kid, it's a bit more, it's a bit harder. I'll see if I can come, that'd be really fun, Reese. But yeah, I just wanted to let you guys know, because I forgot and never mentioned it. I think we're screwed. I think we are screwed. We've got three minutes left of the sponsor mm. stream, so, chat. let's have a look at the map. So... I really like the design they got. It's kind of interesting because when you're at the big hand and you put the light over all of this stuff, you actually, actually... Well, well, well. well. Is it going to load? Woo! One last go. Ooh, what did you get? I've never even heard of Orchard House. Oh, that looks fun. Nice. Fruit-forward and spirit-driven. 
Yo! Oh, here we go. One okay. more, one more, one more time. Okay, I'm focusing on Nexus. I don't even need gems. All right, got. I need Nexus. Oh, we Nexus, got four Nexus. of us again. I forgot we got um, we got uh, Cyberlife. We got Cyberlife. Yeah, I'm glad we get one game where Cyberlife is the one getting slapped rather than slapping. <laughs> Hey, Red Acid Uchiha. Hey, Red Acid. How, how are, are you? Doing, dude? I have a big hand. I don't oh. see the big hand. Uh, oh, he's, he's above our spawn. Yeah. Shit. Oh. Don't perceive me. There are right. countless jokes about being a slapper, but instead of boring you all with them, I'll let you make up your own. Ah. Oh no! Oh, what's so happening? Oh. Mm -hmm. No, I think, I think it's fine. This is good. This is good. I'm not gonna lie, I'm actually kind of annoyed by that. Because I was like, well, he's definitely spotted. <laughs> Hang on. No. Are oh, you getting ganked upon? No. Right, where's the big hands? They're okay, above here's you. the plan. I'm gonna become a cat, and then I'm gonna zip off. You should also become a rhino at some point. I the rhino again. No! You forgot to be the rhino! You idiot! Come on! <laughs> Gonna be a fucking rhino. Hey, um. <laughs> Alright, let's get this Nexus. Mm -hmm. Let's go get a Nexus. I'm Nexusing. Does it do twice as fast when I you're think a. It must, right? It must. You're a cute little cat, I yeah. I know, that's so cute. The Nexusing so hard. He doesn't even know, he's just on the wild lemons. Well, lem lemons is always getting bullied in this game. What's got. What? Keep stealing. Yeah, so we uncatted. Stop the steal! Uh-oh. Uh-oh, we've no. been spotted them. Nah, Wait, nah, no, 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 no. They don't realise. Body it, body it, body they it. They don't realise. Just take it. Boom. Nexus of doom. Can we get two? Can we get two Nexuses? Can we get two Nexus? Let's go. Blah, 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 blah. Get I don't the think board. they realise what's going on. <laughs> Bad I think they knew. Bad hand. Being new in this game that only nine people have played thus far. That's two hours then. It's a demon! Okay. We're about to double Nexus. They're zooming around. They're looking. Yep, yep, yep. They're looking. They're slapping. They missed. Ow. Okay, they did not miss me. I'm on fire. That's not great. Protected, Protected down. down. I was already stealing. Still. All right, to this cool. day. Dude, I look so how's chill. It, how's it I'm going? so pretty. Everything's going amazing. A red double Nexi. They call me Sexy Nexi. Oh, no. <laughs> Not Sexy Nexi. I was going to die. Thanks for the stream. Loved it. Have a good day tomorrow. Thank you, Tommy. Hopefully, I will see you again soon. You have been lit. All right, I'm heading to the exit. You have been lit. I died. Mm, My first death. Die? Explain that. I'm not sure how I died, Em. Time to be a cat. Ski, ba, 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 ba. Try, try spot me now. I got two nexuses. Explain where I've stored them. I'm not explaining it. Get away. Be about one minute. Oh my god, it's countdown. Nine, eight, seven. <laughs> Your phone goes right, I'm, I'm, I'm pussy catting towards the. No. Uh... <laughs> oh! That's so cute. <laughs> it really was. Oh. It really was. Yeah, there's like big springs on the floor. Oh my god. You can do a little with it when you're a cat. You can do a little melee. Oh my god, you can. Yeah. Yo, holy fuck, I'm about to succeed. I'm about to. Dare I say, pop off. I'm opening the portal. What? You got here so much faster. Than I died me. like a bitch. Oh. Oh. That was unfortunate. Don't do it. Where is this dude? I can't see these hands anyway. I don't know. He's pissed. Whoa! He punched me. Should I leave? Yeah. I'm worried. You should definitely leave. Ooh, I'm leaving. Oh, well. Plop. Oh, I'm the best in the world. 
Hello, Fula. Hello. I feel like they should put Fula in there. Feels like the kind of game I should be able to What's play. This? What's his man? What's his hands? Uh oh. Hands! Hands! <laughs> Oh, oh, no. Yes! <laughs> oh my god, what about the other two? I think they might have got out as well. Lemons are. Oh, it ran up behind you and jumped in behind you before he noticed me. Yes! yes! Okay, so the only one left is Cyber. And Cyber, Cyber, Cyber Cyber's getting out, yeah. Oh, uh, let's, let's hear Dude. it. Yo! Squad, 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 squad. Oh, was that you, Ryan? Oh, uh, Ryan! Thanks. If I'd have known it was a mug, Being I'd have been so hard, more right? Info. Yeah, if I'd known it was a mug, I'd have been, I'd have been uh, more... Being the hand is so hard, right, Ryan? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was really good. It gets easier. It looks... It's, four it's people way is harder hard. than it looks. Yeah. Four people is hard. Right, chat, that is chat, us done for the day. Thank you so much for that incredibly delightful stream. We are on yeah. 700 sub points. So you did eat. Thank you. obviously sub daddy. Thank, Thank you, you everyone. Everyone who has given bits. And Scarface coming in with a crisp £1.40. Ooh. Can't turn that down. Ooh. Ooh. But um, chat, that's us mm -hmm. done for the evening. I hope you guys have a... It is a trippy game. I say it is quite somebody. trippy, yeah. Also, thank you everyone on TikTok for the follows and for the roses and stuff. You are amazing. We will see you all tomorrow. If you're missing us in the intervening time, guess what? Fred and I have uploaded a new YouTube video YouTube. this week. Over on Framily. Yeah, so guys, wow. go check out the new YouTube video. Mm -hmm. It's doing quite well. It's got like 350 50 views. It, I think it's... It's surging. It's surging. It's doing well. It was it was eighth, now it's sixth. Yeah. It's going! Chat, so see go check out. Go check that out, and then we'll see you tomorrow. Yeah. Enjoy the rest of your evening. Ciao. Bye.